Hello, everybody. How's it all going? Happy Sunday to you. Rusty Champagne here with you. Supermarket Simulator Early Access. You know it. You love it. It's one of everybody's favorites. And we are here again. And I hope you are having a wonderful weekend. It is really a wonderful weekend. We've been having a lot of fun here. Yesterday, we were watching a bunch of WrestleMania. Tonight, we're going to be watching a bunch more WrestleMania. It is really, a really a fun weekend. And the weather's going to be warmer next week. It is really, really good. Uh, let's see. Who all do we have in chat already? Let's see. Statsman is here. How you doing? Me just weird. Hello. Yoda, how you doing? So good to see you again. Long time no see. Real Shadow Cat, how are you? Diane Smith, good to see you. Sour Patch Kid, hello. Katrina Stockley, good to see you. JW89, also here. How you doing? Joker Ritz, how's it going? Good to see you. Um, other people in the chat, let us take a look. Going down the list. Uh, other people I have not said hi to in the chat. Who we got? We got Carol H. How you doing? Good to see ya. So glad you're here. Kagan plays. Hi. How you doing? Good to see ya. Leslie Peter. Oh, hey. Good to see you. Uh, Kim Wilk, 23 in the Twitch side. How you doing? So good to see ya. Happy Sunday to ya. Uh, Owen Bravery. Hello. Shannon Kelly. How you doing? Stinger Beast. Hello. Leslie Peters, you are here right on time. Michael, it is good to see you. Oh, man. It is a very nice Sunday. Catnip, how you doing? So good to see you. We'll wait a little bit um, as people are walking in. Yes, I am a, a minor wrestling fan. I'm not a huge wrestling fan, but I'm a minor wrestling fan. And one of my favorite channels, again, these guys don't need any kind of a plug for me because they got 850,000 subscribers. But if you like wrestling, you really should subscribe to Wrestle Talk. You really, really should. They are good. I love those guys. They're absolutely wonderful. And Statsman, welcome to the Rusty Champagne Club. So good to have you as a member of the club. Thank you so much for that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That is great. Um, Leanne Hutton, hi. How you doing? Good morning. Just watching you while getting ready to go work in a supermarket. It's so meta. Uh, you missed the old wrestling days. Was it WCCW girl? That is going way back. That is going back to the day. That's for sure. I don't remember when uh, when there was WWF versus WCW back at that point in time. That was a thing too. Ah, uh, Stinger Beast, thank you so much for the gifted membership. That is so nice of you. Thank you, thank you. Me just weird. Courtesy of Stinger Beast. Welcome to the Rusty Champagne Club, and I hope that you have a wonderful stay here as a part of the club. So, yeah, that again, thank you guys so much for the generosity right out of the gate. I do appreciate that so, so much. That is very, very nice. Let's hop in, shall we? Uh, yeah, this game is, it is very satisfying to watch. People, people love this one, man. They absolutely love it. Absolutely do. All right, so we're going to show you a little bit of the stuff that we've done here. Nothing big. Nothing, nothing big. Uh, we did buy another fridge, and we put another fridge here. And we've got a couple of shelves, and we're going to have a couple of shelves here. So we are going to have some back-to-back -back -back shelves right here. It's a mini aisle, a very, very mini aisle. And what this is all going to be for is when we eventually have enough money to go in here, not that, when we have enough money to go in here and get this product license, um, we are then going to put a bunch of that stuff into that fridge and onto that shelf. So we got some yogurt, we got some sugar cane, we got some rice, we got some pasta penne, and then these things are end up going to end up going into a fridge. I am almost positive. I would be willing to stake some decent money on it. So that's kind of what we got. Pisces Chaos, how are you doing? So good to see you on the Twitch side. Hello. Glad you're here. Uh, and then we've got on the uh, Rosie Langer. How are you? Good to see you as well. Glad you're here. So, yeah, that's that's what all those extra shelves are for. So, again, once we get up to about seventeen, eighteen thousand dollars $18,000, we will look into getting that product license. And then I got to figure out where the heck I'm going to put all this. So I'm going to probably have to take another rack 
and set it here in front of the uh, computer. So I'm going to have to probably take this rack, move it over, put another rack here, and it's going to be a thing. But that's just what we're going to have to do, and that's going to be fine. So with all that said, uh, the Humble Budgeter, hi, how you doing? Good to see you again. We are going to get everything rolling. Fred is ready. Fred, it's been a while. It's good to see you again. I hope you had a few, nice few days off. You're watching on both Twitch and YouTube. That's dedication, watching on both right there. That, that is great. Uh, th oh, low Blaze, how you doing? So good to see you. Thank you. Yeah, I, I'm trying to keep the storage room looking as good as I can. I'm really trying. It's getting more and more difficult, but I am trying as best as I can. Humble Pie, hello. How you doing? So good to see you. Glad you're here. So, yeah, Fred, it's been a while. I think we're ready to go. Frank, you ready to go? Have you had a few good few days off? I hope so. Uh, Fritz, you all good to go? You're going to be right here by the beer. You and Frank are going to be the keepers of the beer. Oh, uh, yeah, that's right. I moved the beer over here because this was like the, the beer section now. And Franz, you all ready to roll? I think we're good. Let's go outside, say hey to the Stalker Quartet. We've got Matt. we got Max. We got Mark. We got Marv. They are all here. They are ready to make it happen. I think we are also ready to make it happen. Day, I don't know. We shall find out. Hans Henrik Albertson. Hello. How are you doing? Good to see you. Day something. The store is open for your convenience. I think we're at like, oh, gosh, I don't even know. It's somewhere in the neighborhood. Of, we might be at like 193. Now that I think about it, it might be day 193. So we'll find out. So right now, we really don't have much to do. Uh, we will check the window chicken. We have window chicken there. We have, I believe, a couple boxes of window chicken out here. I will get a few more boxes of window chicken right from the jump. And we will make sure that we have all the window chicken. There you go. One, two, three. And all purchased. So there we go. So not yours. How you doing? Good to see you. Glad you're here. Hope you are having a wonderful Sunday. We are just getting things rolling, getting your window chicken right here. So we got that a little bit there, a little bit there, and we got all the window chicken once again. We are good to go. Whoosh. Right about there. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, the lag. I keep on yeah, I keep on hearing things about the lag. And, I mean, one thing that I've seen that people say that might help combat the lag is, like, turning down your, your – um, quality on the game because like if i look on mine what is the quality on mine if we go here to settings mine is on high and they say if you set it to like medium that might even help so but i've never i have not had too much of an issue with it so it's um <laughs> i started over to see my store is like whoa uh yeah it's uh i don't know i don't think i could even possibly start over I really don't think I could even start over. I just I couldn't even imagine starting over. So I give you all the props in the world for actually doing it, because as far as far as we've come, I just I don't I can't see myself going all the way back to square one again. That feels like it would just be way too much. <laughs> I don't know if I can make it happen, but hey, more props to you for doing it on your own, because you you're a much stronger person than I am for doing that, no doubt. So let's see what. Oh, yeah, that's uh, so we got some tater tots down there because that's all full up there. OK, I'm like, why is that there? But that's why. Oh, it's always nice and quiet at the beginning of these things. And then all the fracas breaks out. It's just always the quiet before the storm. So we're going to do that. Yeah, it brings back memories. I can imagine going back to the very, very beginning when you're just little wee little lads. And getting stuff going from the very beginning. Um, and it's like, oh, yeah, this is what the place looked like way back in the day. Uh, when it was all so small and so simple. And then it got completely nuts. Absolutely nuts. Yeah, I, that, yeah that's what I've seen a lot, Diane, is people, people saying that they just they, they crank down the resolution at least one notch. And it sounds like the only thing that happens if you crank down the resolution is you lose that green highlighting that shows up around the boxes. And that's that seems to be it. Um, nothing else seems to change from what I, again, this is all just from what I've been reading. Oh, my gosh, we ran out of potatoes already. Holy cow. Potato run on day one. Uh, so, I mean, again, 
I don't have firsthand knowledge of that. That's just what I've seen people say. So take that for what it's worth, and uh, hopefully they're correct on that. Okay, all the potatoes are gone. I need a couple of new toilet papers. So let's get that. So one, two, three, and two new toilet papers. One, two. Let's do it. And I got a little corner store bodega. <laughs> back, back to the beginning of everything. Okay, and run all this in and get it taken care of. So all of our taters and get these all up and some toilet paper going to go right there. A little more is going to go right there and a little more going to go right back there. There it is. All of it at Brooklyn. How you doing? So good to see you. Glad you're here. Uh, taking a look over at the Twitch side. We got Terry Cooper over there. How you doing? Good to see you on the Twitch side. Glad you're here. And I hope everyone is having a wonderful, wonderful Sunday. It is great. It is really, really great. Okay, window chicken. Let's get some of that and put it in here. Window chicken in the freezer. There it is. That box is empty and can get thrown away now. There we go. It is out of here. Right there. Dodo, dodo. Lady Fluffy Dragon, how you doing? So good to see you. Glad you're here. Um, oh, I also want to say thank you for all the people who went and raided Canzalone stream after our last stream ended. Uh, <laughs> he seemed like he liked it. Uh, you all confused him like crazy with the with the window chicken stuff. I saw that. So that was, he seemed to be like, what's going on here? Why is everyone asking about window chicken? What's this all about? Lights! <laughs> but yeah, thank you for stopping by and seeing it. All right, let's, tr let's test this right now. So I'm going to go in here right now. I'm going to go to settings. I'm going to go, going to, go to medium. So we're going to try this right now. Uh, right from the jump. And let's see what it's like if we go to medium. Is that helping things? Uh, a little? Maybe a little? Possibly? Maybe? Uh, I don't know. It feels like it's got a little bit better frame rate. Just a smidge. So, yeah, we're going to go with that. It feels like it's a lot brighter in here, though. Man, it's heck bright in here. Whoa! I don't know if they did something with the lights or if that's just because I'm on the medium setting or something. But, man, the lights in here are bright. Just oof. Uh, yeah, if you go back, uh, Lady Fluffy, it's, oh, I'm trying to think of where it was. It was like two hours into his stream. I'm trying to remember what he was streaming. It was something that he was streaming. It started at 5.15 p.m. I can't remember what it was, but it was whatever he was streaming on Wednesday of last week. So whatever he was streaming on Wednesday of last week, it was uh, it was about 5.15 p.m. he started, and it's somewhere around the two-hour mark of that stream. Everybody from here went, and uh, a bunch of people from here went into there and did a little mini raid on his stream. And, uh, yeah, and, and everyone started asking about window chicken, and he's like, what, what are you talking about? I, I, what is this window chicken you're talking about? <laughs> and he was, he was a little bit confuzzled, but uh, it was rather fun. So, so thank you guys again for uh, saying hi to him for me. I do definitely do appreciate that because we always want to support each other all the time. That's always a good thing. Um, we're all in it together. Always want to try and make sure we're all going forward together. Oh, he was yeah, that's right. He was streaming supermarket. That's right because he's been on this big quest to get his storeroom redone. That's right. I remember that now. Thank you. That's what he was doing. Um, it was that. So, yeah, and so he's back there redoing his stock room, and then all of a sudden all the people show up, and they start asking about window chicken. He's like, uh, <laughs> I don't know what you mean. What is this? <laughs> and, uh, yeah, that was, that was a good time. Good times were had by all, or at least I hope they were. So, okay, I missed my – man, everyone's had the window chicken today. Wow, window chicken aplenty. Let's get some more put it up here okay i see how we're gonna be here and i got another full box gonna grab that throw it in there there we go and got that okay so yeah it does feel like the frame rate is a little bit better here so let's let's kick it down one more notch so let's go all the way down let's go to settings let's go to low and let's see what happens now so if we go save and if we go back and 
So now this is even better. And yeah, the so the uh, the green is gone from the boxes. But this does feel faded out. I don't know if I like that. So I'm going to go back to medium. Everything feels real faded out here. So I'm going to go back to medium and save that and go back. And there we go. And continue. Uh, yeah, that looks better. That definitely looks better than it did before. So, okay. All right. What else can I order? Because I'm just kind of standing around acting silly at this point in time. So let's take a look. Those French fries haven't changed. That ice cream hasn't changed. So we'll do those. So French fries, I thought I hit add. There we go. The ice cream, the original ice cream chocolates. That has not changed. A couple of red flowers. So two of those. And what else? I think I got a hummus. And I'll get a couple of candies. There we go. Give them what they want. So a couple of candies. And we'll just get that ready. And now, let's see. I'm going to I'm gonna start helping these guys out. So let's see. I'm going to see what I can grab. So I'm going to grab some tea. And we're going to just help these guys out because that will make things go faster in the morning. So I might as well do that because then they'll be done faster. And if they're done faster, then we can get things going on through days faster. Because there's nothing else I can do right now. So we're going to do this. And just keep on putting things up. And I'm going to run into the door. And I'm going to run into the railing. I'm going to run in all the stuff. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. So there's some bleach. I'm going to grab another bleach. And uh, what did I miss? Oh, oh, so not yours. Thank you again for another gifted membership. I appreciate that so, so much. Uh, Repip Gab. Courtesy of So Not Yours, welcome to the Rusty Champagne Club. I hope you have a wonderful time. And again, thank you, So Not Yours, for yet another gifted membership. I appreciate that so, so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. So we're going to just keep on helping out the stockers and make things a little bit better for them. Let's, okay, we can grab some pepper. It's good that they can, are not necessarily, <laughs> that they, they kind of, restock things in some kind of chaotic way because then I can just help them out and the, I just have to make sure they're not running the same direction that I am um, but they don't seem to be on a regular basis okay that is oh nope there's more in there okay I almost threw that out almost did but did not okay what else do we need get some salt so let's do that grab some salt and yeah this is like going back to the early days back when I was doing all the stocking. Um, I like it. It's, it gives me something to do. because <laughs> and, and like I said, it helps make the mornings go faster because a lot of the time I'm kind of waiting for the stockers to finish their thing up. And if I can help them out, then, hey, why not? And they won't even file a union grievance. I checked with them, and they said, yeah, we're okay with you doing your thing. We're okay with helping us. We're okay with you helping us stock the shelves, even though it is union work. And generally, we would not be okay with that. But in this case, we actually are, and we appreciate the help. So that is nice that they did not say anything to the union steward about this. Uh, Jill, hello. How you doing? So good to see you. Glad you're here. Happy Sunday to you. Um, is everyone done? Look at that. Everyone's done. How about that? Perfect. Let's get into it. Day 193. I was right. Day 193. 81 satisfied. A perfect day. 81,000. We love it. So we're up to $15,000. Like I said, when I get above 20000 I think we will be able to then uh, get that next license. Ooh, J-Dub, got a date going on. Uh, listening to my truck while I wait for my coffee date to show up. Okay. Good luck with your date. Um, if it doesn't go well, let me know. I will call you and tell you that you left your oven on. So uh, just let me know if you need any help. I'll be here for you. I got your back. Okay. Let us get into day 194. So here we go, 194. Uh, someone has to make sure that I remember that it's day 194. So Mimlet cheese, that is the new cheese if I remember right. Yeah, 375. There it is. And how are we doing? Okay, we got to put some more window chicken up, so let's do that. All the window chicken is going away. Man, we've had a lot of window chicken bought yesterday. That's kind of insane how much we had. And I think there's only one in here. So, yep, that's it. 
So that is all of that. And now let us, oh, let's get this order brought in. And go here. Bill, how you doing? So good to see you, Bill. Let's get you taken care of. All good. We've got that. So I'll be back before the live ends if it goes poorly. Let's hope it doesn't go poorly, man. I uh, yeah, we're we're I definitely hope all goes well with it. So best of luck. And yeah, here here's the good stuff. Here's the good coffee. All right, let's get all this put up. And then we can see what else we need to do and go from there. So we got this and what else we got? Oh, yeah, the ice cream. That's right. So put that there. And this was, oh, yeah, our flour. So that's going to go there. Ah, and, and our next flour. There's a part of me that almost wants to help get the stockers done and then get my order done because I feel like it's going to be easier to see what is empty on the shelves before I get start doing my order. I'm, I'm really kind of pondering that. I just don't know, so I I'm kind of I I'm kind of on the fence as to what to do with all this, but at the same time I don't know how we're doing in terms of what we need and what we don't. Okay, so I can grab that vodka for sure. So I'm going to do that. I'm just going to grab the things I know I can get put up, and just kind of keep on helping them out, because that will at least get them done faster. And if they get done faster then I can see what we still need to order and what we don't. So we need a couple of these kegs. So that doesn't help. There's only one in here. That's great. Um, there's that. And then we've got, uh, are you grabbing some? I think you did. I think you grabbed some of those. Those look like those kegs. Yeah, you've got the kegs. You're walking that direction. There it is. And how are we doing on all this stuff? I'll, I'll, I'll let them handle the freezers. I'll focus on all the shelves. And let's see. Uh, some of that bleach. I guess we can grab some of that. There we go. Put that up. And that is now empty. Yeah, because if this gets them done faster, then I can take a look at what I need to order. Get my order done faster. Because that way I don't have to worry about whether or not there are things that are going on the shelves and I'm ordering while stuff's going on. So I think we can get some moussaka up there. Let's take a look there. Uh, it's up there. There it is. And like I said, it helps me harken back to, to days long. Oh, that's lasagna. That's right. That's not moussaka. But I can take the moussaka and put it there. They look so similar. I always forget that. All right. That goes up there. Lasagna can go here. Let's grab some of that and put that up. There we go. And now I think I'm kind of good to get my order done because I feel like there's a lot of stuff up here. So let's take a look. What do we need? Uh, we need a couple of the powdered sugars, a couple of the sandwich breads, a red flour, a blue flour. So a couple of the powdered sugars, a couple of the sandwich breads. And one of the red flowers, one of the blue flowers. So we're going to start getting things ordered here. I need a couple of the Covidos. So we got two of those. And then we're going to go around here. And I can get a moussaka because we're almost out of that. What is that? That's eggs. Why are you there? I don't know. So a moussaka and a couple of tunas. So we'll make that our first order. So moussaka. That goes there. And a tuna. One there. Okay, got that. There's our first order. Next up, another tuna. Run around this way. I need a couple of milk. I need, uh, let's see, a couple of milk, a couple of that that one soda that I, whose name I cannot recall. The one with the really hard name. The, yeah, that one. And then we need, uh, what else? Uh, five, so I'm going to get five red coffees. So five of these. One, two, three, four, five. And there's that. I'm going to, again, get six of the teas. One, two, three, four, five, six. Because I can hold six. Uh, two crispy chibi. So we're going to get that. Crispy chibi. Two of you. And uh, six chocolate bars. There we go. Zen Pyro, how you doing? 
Happy Sunday to you. Glad you're here. Uh, chocolate bars. I think I said six. Yeah, so there's two. And now we're going to get a few more. One, two, three, four. And we're going to keep going around. I need two pasta. I need five ketchup. So two pasta. And five ketchup. One, two, three, four, five. So four. That's fine. I'll just go with four. That works. Uh, I can get a bunch of peanut, peanut butter, jelly. Let's get that. So five peanut butter. All of it. One, two, three, four, five. Going to go back around here. I need that much in shampoo, so I'll get five shampoos. We'll do that. Man, all the kegs went. Man, it was beer fest yesterday. No one told me. So one, two, three, four, five. There's all of those. And now all the kegs. One, two, three, four. And then we look over here. Everything's good there. I need one new toilet paper. So one of you. Look over here. I need two of the, uh, that's one of the ice creams. So two of that ice cream. I can pull that tag. We don't need that tag anymore. So two of the ice cream that's just called ice cream. And then I need one new bleach and two old bleach. So one new bleach and two old. One, one, two. There's that. Next, this shelf. I need one of those beers, two whiskeys, and two kegs. So one of the new beers. That's that one, two whiskeys, and two of the new kegs. There it is. Okay. <laughs> one problem with starting over. I miss my money. I could imagine. I could only imagine starting <laughs> I can only imagine starting over not having the money. Fell asleep in your shop and woke up in Rusty's. Now that would be a shock. <laughs> Fall asleep in one place and you wake up at the supermarket called Supermarket. And you're like, ah, how did I end up here? And why are all these pink flamingos looking up at me? Um, it's Yeah, that's never good. So let's get the rest of this put up. Yeah, I, I jelly's good. I do prefer jam. I prefer jam because of its spreadability. I mean, I like jelly, but I like jam because it's much more spreadable. Um, we used to always have jelly, but now we are a jam household. Um, I introduced Susie Lou to jam, and she is now a jam convert and absolutely loves it, especially given the fact that I normally have a peanut butter and jam sandwich every day, and it makes it so much easier to handle um, because jelly is its good, but it's clumpy. So that's, uh, yeah. Yeah. And, and you don't want a clumpy if you can avoid it. All right. They are still stocking. Still stocking. How are they doing? Reckless Gaming, how are you doing? Happy Sunday to you. Glad you're here. Good to see you. And, yeah, they're still going. So as long as they're still going, I'm going to keep still going. Oh, now they're outside. Now there we go. So we're going to make the, we're going to try and get a bunch of these boxes up, and then we'll get the day going. So... I, if I can get like 20 or 30 of these up, then I think I can get things rolling. So continue talking amongst yourselves. Yeah, very surreal. I can imagine. Um, <laughs> I can only imagine what that would be like. You're watching one video. All of a sudden you wake up and you've got rusty champagne in your ears. And it's like, ah, that wasn't what I was listening to before. And it'll get this all taken care of. Not all of it, but some of it. And that should then get us going. All right. Yeah, this is still the, the most difficult part of the game. It's just the entire stock, restocking the stock room. I mean, I, it's it's amazing to think that we didn't have the stockers before and you had to, like, stock the shelves and the stock room. And it's just like, oh, my gosh. How, how did we even get through this game like that? I just don't know how we even did it. It's it's crazy to think that that was at one point in time a thing. Um, but thankfully, we are long past those days and are in a completely different world. How many more boxes we got out here? We got so many. Um, I'm almost tempted to get things going and just stock while the day's going. I am really half tempted to do that because I could be doing this all morning. And I think I can make this happen while they are doing their thing. I'm... I'm half tempted. Um, let's see. Do I have any boxes on my fire escape? I, I, I am envious 
I'm not part of the cool crowd that has boxes on their fire escape. I don't know how people get boxes on their fire escape. I don't know if that's a result of mods or what it is, but I've seen people end up with boxes on their fire escape, and I just don't feel like I'm part of the cool kids because that has not happened to me, and I feel like I'm missing out. I've got FOMO. I've got fire escape FOMO, and I don't know what to do about it. So I guess I will just have to be one of the kids that has all their boxes actually delivered on the ground and not landing on the fire escape. So that's just kind of the way it is. All right. Enough of this. Let's have this go. Awesome Blossom. How you doing? So good to see you. We're going to get into this. Day 194. The store is open for your convenience. And I'm just going to keep stocking for the next couple hours. And it's fine. It, it, it's fine. We got plenty of boxes out here. I, they can do their thing. I can do my thing. We'll be okay. Because I want to get the days moving. I've got to get the days moving. It's got to happen. We're going to... Oh, the pyramid of boxes. I've seen Bad Wolf in her pyramids of boxes. Um, I joked with her one time that she took Supermarket Simulator and turned it into a platformer. Which, I don't know if that's what the developer ever intended. But, hey, it, there, there you go. It's like Super Mario Supermarket Simulator. And, uh, oh, you can throw boxes on the fire escape. Well, I guess you can do that. Um, I don't know why you'd want to, but I guess if you want to do it for the lulls, then you can. Um, but, yeah, I guess that's one way to go about it. All right. I thought that maybe when they were being delivered that they were landing on the fire escape for some reason. But, yeah, I guess people are just chucking up there, just going, ha, and putting them up there then. Yeah, that's one way to make it happen. All right, get all the boxes out of the street. So many boxes in the street. There's another one. And two. Oh, I was not. I was looking at my chat when I ran into that wall. I, I blame that on walking into the chat. So let's see. Yeah, that's that. And put that there. Okay, some more chocolates. And we'll put that there. Yeah, we're in good shape. This is fine. It's all good. We're all good. Going to make all this happen. And I really wish that they'd get you to the point where you could carry more than one thing. Because in real life, you can carry more than one thing, even when you're going up and down stairs. It is possible. And I know that there's the mod that like automatically teleports everything to your racks, and I think that that's all nice and cool. But again, I'll, <laughs> I'll wait and see if the developer ever puts that into the game. And if he does, I will be more than happy to see it. But it is cool to see. That's for sure. Okay. Now we got all the coffees. Nope. That's not coffee. That's coffee. So didn't throw mine either. Yeah. I, I, don't, I don't know how that's happening for some people that they're just ending up there. It's so weird. Some, some kind of strange thing in the game is making that happen. And I don't know what it is. But it is, I guess, kind of funny. <laughs> uh Unlimited order mod. Oh, and you ordered 82 things at once. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the game wouldn't know how to handle 82 things at one time. Uh, so it just, yeah, things probably it was a, like a giant splashdown situation going on is probably the thing. So, yeah, I could see where maybe that would be the thing, especially since everything kind of parachutes in without a parachute. It just all lands on the ground. Look at that. We got all that done. Made it happen, and I don't think that anyone's the worse for it. And, yeah, it's like already 2 o'clock in the afternoon. So it's 9 in the afternoon. All right, let's take some quick drink of water. Window chicken. Let us check the window chicken. Let's do it. Check in the window chicken. How are we doing? Uh, okay, got one. Did I order? No, I didn't even order any. Whoa, gosh. Okay. Um, hurry. One, two, three, four, five, six. All the window chicken. Boom. Let's get it. Grab some. Grab that. Oh, right into the door. Ouch. That's an HMO bill. And there's one. And we'll get another one. Bring that in. And put that right there. All good. <laughs> Almost ran out. Almost. You get some seasoning. And you're going to go there. We'll take the others. Set them here. And everything will be fine. It's fine. It's fine. Set some there. Yeah. And got some here. It's always funny when you have people that have never seen the window chicken before. And they're like, why do you have the chicken outside? Well, I mean, there's a reason. And there we go. Got it. Uh, yes, I did. 
song by uh, it's a song by Panic in the Di- Panic at the Disco. Nine in the afternoon. Good song. You should listen to it. Look it up on either Spotify or Pandora or whatever your music thing of choice is. It's nine in the afternoon. Um, and that's why it's so funny because there's never a nine in the afternoon. So they're so crafty, those guys. And uh, let's see, a couple of elbows. Got to have my elbows. It's important to have your elbows. And all of those, which one is that? That's the pulp. So let's see. Um Mistakes were made moments. I love mistakes were made moments. Those are always great. Uh, let's see. What else can I do? What else can I do? I guess a couple of new flowers. So we'll do a couple of new flowers. And what else? Um, hmm. I can get a couple of those new cheese. We'll do that. Oh, it's starting to get dark. So a couple of new cheese. One, two. And we know, oh, order it, dummy. There it is. And once again, we'll run in here and lights. And that's good. i got to do my best to not run into that beer fridge now. All right, I can get a couple of Rapicos. Because I see, not RPO, Rapico. So we'll get a couple of those. And I will get another hummus, I guess. So I'll get a couple of hummus, not HO. There we go. Hummus. And uh, I now I can't even remember what I ordered and what I didn't. I didn't order a keg, so I'm going to get a keg. So I'm going to do that. And how about on this shelf? Uh, everything on this shelf is good because that tends to be my blind spot, that shelf. I need, uh, let's get a whole bunch of ground beef, and we'll do that. So a whole bunch of ground beef. And one, two, three, four, five. And now I should probably go outside and start bringing this stuff in. But I don't think I got any milk six packs. I'm almost positive I'd not not get milk six packs. So one, two of those. And I think I got the new flour. I'm pretty sure I did. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I did. So, yeah, now we're going to get a bunch of this stuff, start bringing it in. Um, And we'll see what we got because it's going to be too late for me to do an order again anyway uh after i put all this stuff up so we're just going to do our best and we'll be in a little bit better shape for the morning at least with this and i'm going to for sure have a couple extra boxes because that's the way it rolls and i'm f- ordering while they're filling and inevitably we end up with an extra box here and there so <laughs> that's the way it is it's the price you play to play this game um, of ordering on the run and yep there's my extra elbows so we'll set that there and I've started yelling lights with turning on my lights. I, I've started a trend. Um, as long as you don't do it at home, because then people will really look at you like, uh, what's the matter with you? Why are you yelling that when you turn on the light switch? Um, but it could be funny. So there's that. Oh, I don't have any. Oh, I don't have any sushi. That's going to come back to bite me. Um, not having any sushi down there. I can see that being an issue. I can definitely sense it. And because night owls love their sushi. They do love a good sushi. And more out here. Okay, good. I did order that new flower. I was wondering whether or not I had ordered that. And the answer is yes. <laughs> Extra elbows. <laughs> Sometimes you need more than two elbows. Uh, I don't know why. I couldn't really tell you. So it, it just sounds like a thing. Okay, here's our Rapico. going to put that now. And then we've got our other spaghetti. Again, because everybody loves carbs in this town. This is a carb-heavy town. It's so strange. Everybody loves their carbs. There's the pulp. And that's the other Rapico. So there we go. Night owls are going to town. We're back over $15,000 again. So more pulp. And we got our new cheese back there and then we've got some more ground beef because i ordered all the ground beef so i got ground beef for days in our stock room that may or may not be refrigerated no one knows for sure um if it was even if it was refrigerated the ice cream would be melting so it's hard to tell maybe it's maybe maybe certain parts maybe the sections know what's in there and it sets everything to the proper temperature so maybe if we look at this shelf Maybe these are all frozen because there's frozen product on here, but this one's not because it's got regular product on here. Maybe that's what it is. Um, might need someone to look into that for me. I Yeah, the, there's a lot of things that they need to look into for me. 
A lot of things. Yeah, they do love baking in this town. They absolutely love baking. I don't know what it is, but they absolutely love it. All right, let's get a couple of each of the sushis. So one, two, one, two. And what else do we need? Uh, I can get a potato. I can get uh, one new toilet paper and two old ones. So uh, toilet paper, one new one. Click. Two old ones. And how about over here? Uh, I can get two of the green beans. So there we go. Two green beans. And one, two. All right. That is ready. Now let us uh, get everything. Do I know if the update is going to be some of the things on the menu page list or more patches? To be honest with you, I don't even know when the next update's going to be. Uh, I, I'm guessing that he's probably working on one. But when it's going to come out, I honestly do not know. So I, I have no idea what when it will be or what will be in it. Um, but uh, hopefully it will have some good stuff in it. Um, and hopefully it will be soon. But, yeah, uh, fingers crossed because I'm not quite sure when that will be happening. Let's check the window chicken. Oh, yeah, once again, all the window chicken is needed. So I might as well stock that because I'm the only one who can. And I think they're done again. Oh, no, uh, Fred's still going. Fred's got a little bit still happening. So let's take that and zip. There we go. All is well. And I think, again, I think we're done for the day. I'm pretty sure we're done. Hey, Fred, how's it going? Good to see you. Glad you're here. Yeah, everybody is done. Wow. We are just purring here. $17,000. Oh, that's getting closer. Let's see how much money I've got when we're done with the uh, order. The self-checkouts would definitely be nice. I would be all about a self-checkout. I would be all about that. Let's see. Uh, day 194. Oh, wow. 84,000. Look at us go. Uh, made another $2,600. Got seventeen thousand two hundred in the bank now, so we're getting closer. But I got to see how much money we're going to have after the order happens. So we got to check that out. So let us get here. Shampoo is up. Shampoo is over here, and this is wow, seven fifty for shampoo. Price of shampoo is going up. And let's see. I desperately need a self checkout. Me and my guys can't keep up. They do their best. They absolutely do their best, but the night owls make it crazy. They absolutely make it insane. Um, that's just how they roll. <laughs> it's like we are going to come in and we are going to buy all the product, and you will like it. So, yeah, I'm going to help out the stockers a bit and try and get some more of this stuff up here, and that will help me with my order. So that's that's my plan. Try and do a little bit of this, and then we'll we'll see how everything's looking from there. So, all right, and I do have to bring this in as well. So let's get this ordered, and we're going to go uh, to take care of the bills. That's what I was going to do. Bill, how are you doing? Good to see you. It's funny because my neighbor is Bill, too. <laughs> He's outside mowing his lawn right now as we speak because he loves mowing his lawn. He absolutely lo loves mowing his lawn. It grows an eighth of an inch, and he's out there mowing it again. He makes me look very, very bad because he is an overachiever. Okay, so not yours. Again, thank you so much for another gifted subscription. Zen Pyro! Zen! Courtesy of so not yours, you are now a member of the Rusty Champagne Club. And I hope that you enjoy your membership. Thank you again, so not yours. That is so wonderful. I appreciate that so, so much. Um... Okay, let us, uh, let's us let take a look around. So I, I did order all, okay, so I can get uh, all the bleach because I did run us out of bleach. I, I ran us out of the old bleach, so I know I need those, and I know I need the coffees, so I need six of those. And I know I need, I guess, a couple more green beans. I thought I ordered those, or are they outside? No, they're out here. That's right. I got to bring this all in. That's what it is. Okay, I almost messed that up. Almost messed that up. So let's get that fixed. Phew. You, you get to talking too much and you forget what you're doing. And you know me. I talk way too much. So we'll get this all happening. Get this all brought in. Yeah, there's my green beans I almost ordered again. Almost thought about it. And uh, some taters. Bring those back there. And then we've got, again, UPS hates me today. Threw all my stuff all the way down by the tree. 
I'm sorry, UPS. I don't know what I said. I don't know what it was. I'll I won't do it anymore. Okay. There's that. And we've got our little sushi to go with our big sushi. And one more little sushi. Okay. All right. Let's see. How are they doing in here? Uh, what's going on? I can get some pepper for sure. There's got to be some pepper. They, no, I'm out of pepper. Wow. Okay. Uh, is, what else? How are we looking in other places? Kind of go around the room. Uh, some honey, maybe? Let's grab some honey. Let's do that. And put that up. So, going to take that honey, put it up. Everything there is good. Everything there is good. Uh, maybe some of the cleaner? I wonder if we have one. Nope, we don't. All right, so let's actually start ordering some stuff here. Let's do this. So I'm going to get, man, they went through the bleach again. I thought I already put, oh, no, it's in the register, isn't it? Did I not? Order? Yeah, I didn't. Oh, gosh. So I've got two bleach. I've got six coffee. And let's get a couple of pepper. Let's do that. UPS does hate everybody. It's a UPS conspiracy. It's part of big UPS. Um, so there we go. So I've got two pepper outside. Let's do that so um so let's see we need two red flowers and let's do that so two red flowers one two and then we're gonna go around i need uh those are the the egg 12s i keep on moving the egg 12s so your order will arrive at 11 47 13 well you're not going to tell you what day but it's going to arrive at 11 47 13 um, you, you get to figure out what day it is. And those are, that's the hams. So, yeah, the, each of the hams. So the ham pastries, the ham and cheese. We will do that. And uh, bleach and tea is a weird combination. No doubt about it. Don't drink them together. That would not be good. A white label and a zap. We will do that. So white label and zap. There's 10 outside. Keep going around. That's the hummus. I cannot put that away. Um, everything there is good. Everything here is good. I'm going to get one brown label cereal. Let's do that. And there you go. Uh, brown label cereal. Got that. Uh, <laughs> yeah, the mail is... Yeah, don't, don't get me started on the mail. Uh, it's a... They, it's not what it used to be. That's all I'm going to say. It's not what it used to be. Candy, give them what they want. It is definitely not what it used to be. All right. Uh, I'm going to get a, a bunch of those rice. So let's just do that. And then we're going to go out here, get three of each of those rice. So one, two, three. One, two, three. And do that. And now we're going to go here. I need all the bug cleaner and all the regular cleaner. So let's do that. Well, it's good to know that we're not the only ones with bad postal service because, yeah, the postal service, again, at one point in time, the postal service didn't used to be bad, but now it's just like, ugh, just not, not good. Okay, so two of the vodkas, let's do that. All right, one, two, and we've got a couple of the beer kegs. So one, two, and we need what? Uh, a one of the Big Tony pizzas and a veggie blend. So Big Tony and the veggies. There we go. Veggie mix. Okay. That's all out there. Uh, it's bad here. Yeah. Man, everybody's got the bad mail. It's a thing. It is a definitely a thing. All right. Is it? Uh, let's take a look at what we got outside. Because now I'm at the point where I don't even remember what I've ordered and what I haven't. So we're going to do this. Start putting this stuff up. And get it on the shelf. So. Uh, where is that goes there? So. <laughs> temporarily losing my mind a little bit. It's okay. Uh, oh man. Here we go. I ordered extra of both of those. So I'm going to have boxes on the floor again. Once again. That's how it's going to be. That's fine. No worries. So, uh, one thing I did want to mention, for our live stream tomorrow, I have already had a couple people ask me about it, and I am going to do this. So, for the live stream tomorrow at 4.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time, 
Um, I am going to be doing another. I'm going to be doing a live stream of that wonderful wacky game, Center, Center Station Simulator. Um, if you didn't see it earlier, uh, you should really check it out because it was a bit humorous, um, and it's uh, it's it's worth a view if for no other value than the comedy. It's I, I, again. I, it's like I said in the chat, if you saw it in the chat, the game, I feel, has some interesting bones. It's just got a, a not very well fleshed out tutorial. So we are going to, uh, now that we know what we know with the game, we're going to give it a whirl, and we're going to see what it's like, and we're going to do it all live. And that will be at 4.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time, Center Station Simulator, and we're going to see what other goofy stuff they have us build in this abandoned supermarket called the Rusty Cart uh, because it actually has a name. And we're going to see if we actually are going to get some people that show up at this place, this place where delivery trucks cannot go, but cars can come and go as they please. It's a weird thing, but it looks like it could be really, really interesting and really, really fun. We're just kind of got to get through that beginning part. And, and lo, if you play the game, whatever you do, just make sure you set your key bindings at the very beginning. Like I said, uh, just if nothing else, like watch the first couple minutes of my video. And uh, yeah, because for whatever reason, at the beginning of the game, they don't have the key bindings set properly. Don't ask me why. I don't have the answer. Um, they have some a couple of bad translation issues, which is interesting because I'm pretty sure that the game is designed in France or in French Canada, one or the other. So, like, the word enter, is a, it's, it's a distinct word in French. But for whatever reason, instead of using the word enter, it's, it uses the word join. So it tell, instead of telling you to enter a place, it tells you to join a place which is a head scratcher. So, but it's, it, it, it is interesting. It really is interesting. And I really feel like there's something there. I really feel like there's something there and it's just getting past that, the, the weird things into tutorial because the tutorial is definitely weird. There's no doubt about it. And, and again, it's version, it's literally version 0.1.0 of the game. So it's like the very first version. And yeah, they probably could have play, play tested it and maybe waited a little bit. My opinion, my opinion only. But, uh, but yeah, I, I feel like there's something there. And I've got to check it out. And we've got to see what it's going on. So someone complete the tutorial for that game in six hours. Okay, well, at least that tells me how much I've got to go. Uh, lots of, lots to do. Took cans alone six hours to complete the tutorial. I did watch a little bit of the beginning of his, and I, re I remember him looking extremely confused as to what was going on. And that makes perfect sense because it was confusing. Again, with the key bindings not being right, you're like, why am I pressing the one button and nothing's happening? And then you look and the thing is bound to a completely weird key. It's a head scratcher but it looks like it's going to be very, very interesting. So we're going to see. Um, all right. Who, who else uh, showed up? Let's see. Uh, Sherry Greasby, DMP Alfonso. How you doing? Good to see you. And we are going to go over here. I see Yoda getting ready to warm up the hammer. I think it's coming. I think it's going to drop, and that's fine. So we're going to, while that's going on, we're going to go in here. Day 195. The store is open for your convenience. We don't have that much left to put up here. So let's go. Make this happen. Get this put away. And, oh, yeah, I've still got to do my taxes, too. Still got to do my taxes. Moxie84, how you doing? Good to see you. Oh, my gosh. Over on the Twitch side. I've missed so many people on the Twitch side. I'm so sorry. Mortimer Chaos Shade Grim. How are you doing on the Twitch side? Good to see you. St. Carlos, good to see you. Uh, GRA1, so good to see you on the Twitch side. Um, and Teresa Lilly, hi. How are you doing? Good to see you on the YouTube side. Glad you're here. And we are going to take this and put that there. Okay. All right. Huh. Uh, can I put this up? No, I can't. 
So I'm going to have a few boxes on the ground, and that's fine. It's all good. It's all part of the supermarket called supermarket. I'm, I'm waiting for the day that they allow you to change the name of your supermarket. I, I know that it'll happen, and it's going to be a sight to see when you do. Uh, I just don't know when. Uh, five more days until the 200-day party. That's going to be crazy that we'll be have played this for 200 days. Absolutely crazy. Ah, uh, Chip, how you doing? Good to see you. I think I saw you over on the YouTube side as well. Glad you're here. Hope you are having a wonderful day. <laughs> Yoda has made her way to the cabinet. She has made her way to the cabinet, and I do not blame her. Absolutely do not blame her. Okay. Um, I don't catch everything, but I do catch some stuff. Uh, Fred Nick Teddy, have I said hi to you yet? I don't know if I did. And if I did, hello again. And if not, hi. Um, I can't remember. Because you guys are always so active in chat, and I absolutely love that. I absolutely, absolutely love that. Um, it does make it interesting to try and keep up, but I absolutely love it. Okay. Got some oil. One, two, three, four, five. And I think there was something else over here that I could get a bunch of. Oh, we can always get another pasta because it's all the carbs here. All the carbs, all the baking. And uh, what else? Yeah, I'm, I'm slow on the uptake. I'm very slow on the uptake. <laughs> I'll be the first to admit it. Uh, let's get a few pepper and a few salt. We'll do that. So we'll get a few pepper, a few salt. Or a couple pepper and a couple salt. So a couple of those. Get that. Get a couple salt. And just keep going. And, uh, yeah, then we've got a couple of flour. And we're going to do that. And, nope, just one. They brought one back. They brought one back. So they, oh, I got rid of both of them. So, shoot. And I didn't pay the bills. I am just losing it today. It is not my day. Oh, I did pay the bills. All right. Uh... One of those. Yeah, I'm, I'm all askew. I am all askew. Let us take a look. And what else we got? Uh, oh, yeah, butters. Let's get some butters. Let's do that. And one, two, three, four, five. Let's do five. And that's that hummus that still can't go on the shelf. And how about over here? Uh, toilet paper? Yeah, we'll get a couple of toilet papers. We'll do that. So toilet. And not loy. Toilet. And one, two. All right. Let's bring all this in. Let's go on. And, and just like that, the room got a little lighter. <laughs> it's, it's always interesting. It really is. Um, and this is why I love my mods. And... I will always be in their debt and in their gratitude. <laughs> it's because of stuff like this. So, as always, much love to Yoda, much love to Jada, and oh, and much love to what for everything that they do to keep the ship running on a on a positive course. Um, because every once in a while things get squirrely, because it is life, and life gets kind of crazy. Exotic butters, and you've got to. <laughs> And you just got to keep pivoting. It's cool. Okay. So we're going to put this here. Um, and get this butter and get it here. And uh, what is that? That's uh, some of the oil. There we go. Yeah, that's probably the case. It is probably absolutely the case. And just trying to be funny. And meh, eh, eh. It, it gets it gets handled, so it's all it's all good. It, it's little crazy comedic entertainment. Lights um, that needs his ears boxed. <laughs> uh, and um, we're gonna grab that and then more butter. Got all the butter, all the exotic butters. Gonna throw that all there. And, yeah, now this is just like oil and butter outside, so I don't think I have to worry about it. Oh, there's some pepper out here as well. Uh, Catherine, how you doing? You're not late. It's good. We're, we're all having fun. We're having a good time. So you haven't missed too much. Um, it's, it's, been a, it's been your normal day here for the most part. Uh, all the love, all the goofiness. 
It's it's a good thing. And we're glad that you're here. Here's some artisanal pepper. Let's get that put up. Okay. And window chicken. Uh, shoo. Yeah, how are we doing? Oh, we're okay. Wow, that's actually good. And let's grab that box and put it up. And run over here. Shoot. Got it. And uh, let's see. Oh, so not yours. You're at it again. Again, thank you so much. Oh, man. Sharon Greasby, Mighty Dave, Savage Valco, Knucklehead, Anne Marie, Sarah Prophet, Helen Horn, Huyo Bish, Monique P., Gabriela Jimenez, welcome to the Rusty Champagne Club. Again, courtesy of So Not Yours, whose generosity knows no bounds. Uh, thank you again for for that. Um, Single-handedly trying to make everybody a member of the Rusty Champagne Club. Uh, I probably ought to get some milk six packs. Uh, order those real quick before I'm out of time. And we'll do that. Um, yeah, trying to break me again. I see your game. I see your game. I know how you do it. And Fred Neck Teddy also doing it. Fred Neck Teddy again. Thank you as well. Uh, let's see. Who's it? Who we got now? Luna. We got Kenneth Granquist. We got uh, MTG Pagey. Got Jeff Ewart. We got Donut Playing Games. We got Ty Fox. We got Kara. We got Just Me. We got Simply. And there might have been one. Oh, and Tom Isaac. Welcome to the Rusty Champagne Club, courtesy of Fred Neck Teddy. Again, you guys are so generous. Thank you so, so much. Ram Raj, how you doing? So good to see you. Happy Sunday to you. It's it's going crazy. People are getting a little bit crazy again um, in all the best ways. It's the best crazy that there is. It is the Rusty Champagne crazy, and I absolutely love it, and I absolutely love you guys for it. And I, I again, I thank you, thank you, thank you um, for all that. It's uh, it is it is really really wonderful. Okay, um, that's good. That's good. It, was that the? Oh yeah, that was the ham pastries. So that's going to go there. And let's see, what can I order real quick so I can get a couple of blue flowers? I can get a couple of the chips. So let's get a couple of each of those. So a couple of the blue flowers and a couple of the chips. And we're going to ding for a while. We do love the dinging. And uh, a couple of both of the chips. So we're going to do a couple of those, a couple of those. And going to go around, oh, uh, three of the kegs. So that's what I'm going to do. And three of the kegs and one of the vodkas. And that'll be the entire order. One, two, three, and one of those vodkas. And that's that order. Okay, now let's go upstairs. And see. Uh, what do we have here? We got uh, window chicken. Some more window chicken coming on. And there it is. And we will get this put away. And put that out. And there we go. So, yeah, I've got like three boxes that each have one chicken in them. That's how it goes. All right, so the order's done. All right, let's take a look around, and let's see what we can get up. Do I have any of that soap? I do. Perfect. Let's grab some of this. Going to once again help out the stocker crew, make them go a little bit, make their life a little bit easier. And we're going to keep doing this and keep putting the rest of this. Okay, this one was full. Good. There we go. And Aiden Tysick, how you doing? Good to see you. Lurk away. All the lurking. Make it happen. Good to see you. Um, what was I doing? I was standing here pondering my life choices, looking around. Um, I wonder if they're going to come back with more of those elbows. I'm going to leave that there for now, just in case they come back with some. Is everybody done up here? They are. Wow. It's all going. And we continue chirping. Oh, I'm going to stretch. Uh, big stretch. There we go. Big stretch. And day 195, 84,000. Perfect. Again, love it. 7,400. We got, well, we're up to almost $20,000. I think we can get the, I think we can get that license now. I'm pretty sure we can do it with $20,000. 
I think so. So chicken legs, elbows, and milk six packs. So chicken legs, uh, five seventy five, and elbows and milk six packs. So milk six packs are here. Oh wow, they're way down nine and a quarter, and elbows. Uh, they're going to be there, and oh, okay, that's still eight dollars. Okay. And <clears throat> let's get the order taken care of. Okay, so that can for sure go there now. Uh, this hummus can for sure go there now, I believe. And let's get this put in. Uh, Dan Larson, welcome to the Rusty Champagne Club. Thank you so much for joining us. I appreciate that so, so much. Thank you. I hope you have a wonderful time. There's lots of peeps, and they are more than happy to have you here. Okay. Um, and so am I, for that matter. Uh, and let's get all this put away. Okay, now I get one extra box of COVID uh, I'm going. That's going to be a thing. And then, yeah, we're going to look and see what we can do. Legs, elbows, and a six-pack. Now all we need is a head. We have a full body. Um, we're going to see uh, what we are, what kind of shape we're in for being able to get the product license. Because I'm almost positive we can do that now. I don't think we're going to have an issue there. I really don't. But I want to try and get all the stocker crew done with their thing. And when they get done with their thing, we can kind of take a look at everything and see how we're doing. So that's the plan, is to get the stocker crew done as fast as, they can, as, fast as we can. So then we can start looking around at uh, getting our order in and... Um, and then seeing how much money we have left for the license. So let us check that out. As I kind of talk out loud and run into stuff at the same time, like a tree. Okay, so what? What? how can we help these guys out? What can we do? Um, they're they're kind of good. Uh, shampoo, I guess. Yeah, I can grab some shampoo. So I'm going to grab as much stuff as I can and try and help them out with getting stuff up. <laughs> Of course, there's the one, there's the box with the one thing. Uh, David Getty, how you doing? Good to see you from Minnesota. Welcome to you in Minnesota. Hope you're doing wonderful up there. Uh, and hopefully weather is starting to get a little bit better up there um, in the springtime. Let's see. And uh, what else? So I guess I can get some of the teas and some of the chocolate bars. So let's check on the teas and chocolate bars. What are they grabbing? They're not grabbing teas and chocolate bars, so I'm good there. So let's grab some of this and put some of this up. There we go. We'll grab some of the other tea, this one, and put that up. Because, yeah, I, just, I want to try and get these guys done as quickly as I can. And then I can start working on getting the next product license up here. And chocolate bars. There we go. Got that. Uh, tiny vinyl hands. Hey, how you doing? Good to see you. Happy Sunday to you. We are getting stuff put away. And then we're going to see how much money we have and potentially get the next product license. That, that is the plan. So we're kind of looking at our shelves. I guess I can get some of the Rapico. Grab some of that. Let's do that. Let's grab some Rapico. That's down here. And put this up. And... There we go. Not much. So they're still doing a little bit of stuff. But I think they're pretty close to done now. Are a couple of them actually outside? No. I thought that maybe one or two of them were outside now. But not. Bad Wolf! Hey! How you doing? Happy Sunday. Uh, Callie, how you doing? So not yours uh, So not yours and Fred Neck Teddy. Both, uh, both got some things happening here. They definitely got some things happening. No doubt about it. Um, it's, a, it's some Sunday, some Sunday stuff has been going on courtesy of the two of them. Um, all right. So five of those sugars and is it five of the other sugar? Yeah. So we'll do five of those. All right. There's that. And now we've got uh, three potatoes. So let's do three potatoes. And I know I need some window chicken, so I'll do that at the end. Uh, if I look around here, I need uh, a few of those mashed potatoes and two pasta spaghettis. So those, 
and a couple pasta spaghettis. All right, so there's that. And how about here? Uh, I need some. Oh, <laughs> got here just in time. I'm getting ready to order some crab sticks. So a uh, big crab makes its presence known. So crab sticks and French fries. So there we go. And uh, hot dog and fried onion time. Ooh, that sounds good. So crab sticks and French fries. One, two. And French fries. One, two. There it is. And uh, oh, I got those in a bleach and a veggie. We get a bleach and a veggie. <laughs> Which bleach was it? It was that one. It was the new one. So bleach and the veggies. So veggie mix. There it is. All right. So how much money do we have? 17292 I think that's going to be enough. There we go. There's the crab sticks made out of 100% real fake crab. Um, big crab. We'll let you know. And we've got the veggies. And we'll get, yeah, I want to get most of this put away. And then we're going to see how we're looking back here and then work on getting the product license. We're going to make this happen. Because at that point, the stocker crew should also be done doing their stuff. Um, it should be happening. I would hope, fingers crossed, that we can get all this going. And can that go? Nope, that was the extra. That was the one I ordered. So that was the bonus one. Doo -dee -doo -dee -doo. So let's see. What else is happening in the world? So, yeah, we're going to be watching the second part of WrestleMania tonight. So for those of you who are wrestling fans, um, yeah, that's going to be a lot of fun. Definitely looking forward to some of the matches here. Uh, haven't watched a lot of WrestleManias, but I've watched the past few. And, and way, way back in the day, I used to watch it as well. But, yeah, this should be a fun one. Definitely looking forward to seeing how the main event goes tonight. That'll be, a, that'll be a lot of fun. I was not surprised at all by the way it ended last night. I figured it was going to end that way because it was the only way to me that it made any sense. So uh, it'll be, that'll be fun to see. Be doing that. We're going to have some homemade uh, paninis. Uh, here goes So Not Yours again. Uh, <laughs> there, there we go. One more time. We got 20 more people again. Thank you again so, so much. I just thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I, again, I appreciate it so much. And, uh, yeah. And I'm, then I'm reading other stuff here. So, uh, yeah, so 20 more people that are now members of the Rusty Champagne Club, courtesy of So Not Yours. Uh, again, thank you so much for the generosity. It, it, yeah. All right, let's get all this put away. Um, and then, yeah, like I said, from there we are going to see uh, how, much, uh, how much stuff we still need to get. And then how much money we're going to have for the next product license. Because I think we're going to be good. I think we're going to be in good shape. Because I think, yeah, we got plenty of money. So we can definitely make that happen. Um, no. <laughs> no relation. No relation at all. Uh, <laughs> that'd be a lot for even one of my siblings or one of my family members to donate. That's for sure. Uh, for sure. My Team Cody Rhodes or Team Rock? Uh, I got to be Team Cody Rhodes. I mean, I love The Rock, but I got to be Team Cody. This Roman Reigns being the champion thing can't last. It cannot keep going. He's been the champion for way too long. It's, they've got to make a change at this point. They were so close to making the change at WrestleMania 39, and they didn't pull the trigger. If they don't make the change after WrestleMania 40, there's going to be a revolution in a bad, bad way. So, yeah, that's the way I'm looking at it. The Bear Cave, how you doing? Good to see you. Um, have fun with the editing. Remember, cross dissolves and star wipes. We want cross dissolves and star wipes. That's what we want. So don't forget them. Um, okay, let us get this. All right, so I, get, I need a couple of toilet paper. Let us get this product license. Let's do this. Because we got $17,293, so we can do this. Let's go. And I've got to also pay the bill. So management, bill, bill. That's done. Oh, I should have stayed in there. Licenses. Okay. Boom. We are now caught up on licenses. 
look at that. We are caught up on licenses. Look at us go. And now, let us see what these things need. So if we look at what these need, I know some of them need fridges. Some of them are going to need the shelf. So we got one, two, three, four, five. One, or no, I can count, really. One, two, three, four that go in a fridge. Three that go in a shelf. Hashtag we are Cody Crybabies. Uh, Dan Larson also getting in on the act. Thank you for the gift of 10 Rusty Champagne memberships. Oh, man. Again, thank you guys so, so much. Uh, and so many more new people that are part of that. Uh, again, thank you, thank you, thank you. I would, uh, I, I appreciate it very, very much. Okay, so let, let's get uh, one of these ordered. Yeah, and I'm, I, yeah, there's, it's like divergent chats going on here. Uh, so many things happening. All right, one of each of these. And we're going to, I might start moving some stuff around as well. It might be time to start moving a little bit of stuff as part of all this. But I don't want to make this take too long. I, I really don't want to make this take too long if I can't. So this sugar is going to go here. That's going to go right there, right by that other sugar. And we'll be fine with that. So we'll do that. Now this yogurt. So now I want to, I want to try and get the yogurt together. But that means I've got to move the butter if I'm going to do that. But if I move the butter, where am I going to move the butter? Uh, because I really want the yogurt to be together. So, all right, let's drop this. And let's grab this butter. And let's empty all the butter out from here. And so no one can come and restock it. So I'm going to just take all this out here so no, no one can come back and restock any of the butter. Um, because if I, if I leave this like this, if I leave the butter in there, then they're going to come out and, um, and restock it as I go. Uh, I should have a sub counter. I, I just I don't want to have one on the screen. That's all. I mean, I, I know, I've, I've seen people that do that, but I don't worry about having it on the screen. So maybe move both of the yogurts instead. Oh, I could have done that. Uh, but this one's fine where it is. That works. So, yeah, I'm, I'm already I'm too far invested now. So we're going to do this. And, again, I, I don't want to get too crazy with this. I just want to get all this put away. And, again, now that all the other butter's not in the rack, they can't come and refill this. So that's the um, that's the point. I honestly, I'm wondering what clotted cream is as well. I've heard of it. I just don't know what it is, but I've heard of it. Uh, now I think I can refill this. Yes, it does refill. That's good. I was hoping that was going to be refill, refilled. And let's put one in there so it automatically changes that tag. All right. That's perfect. So now I can put the butter away. And I'll do that in a minute. This pasta... So now, okay, so now this is where I'm going to start getting into this big shelf that I've got here. So we're going to do this. All right, so we're going to do this. We're going to finally have like four facings of potatoes. We're going to have all the potatoes up here now. And not that I need them, but we're going to do that anyway. All right, so you get down. All right, now we're going to take you. And we're going to have this be nothing but potatoes. So all potatoes here. All right. And these are going to move from here. And then these are going to go here. And those are gone. And those are going to go there. And then I'll have one more facing of potatoes. And, oh, let's do this. So that way they rem that way they know that these are potatoes. There. So now they know those are potatoes. And they will um, fill those up. And now I can... Uh, get this taken care of. All right, so that will... All right, let's take those tags off. Perfect. Those tags are off. And um, have fun with the NASCAR. Uh, have fun with the NASCAR. That should be fun. Okay, and I grabbed the pasta. And I already put the pasta back here. So, yeah, I, where did I put it? I thought I did. Yeah, here it is. So, yeah, so I'm going to have this pasta. So we'll have rice and pasta together. So this is pretty good. Penne regate. All right, so there's that. There's a third one. Now what do we got? Uh, oh, yeah, this is the, um, 
The clotted cream. Okay, I wonder if that's like creme fraiche. I don't know. Huh. In the end, I'm going to have to put some stuff over into this one anyway. So what are the other things? So what are the other things that I've got? So we've got the cream. I've got cheese. I've got, oh, and I've got two kinds of cheese. So I might just take the cheese and put them together. So if I do that, then I want to move the cheese together. Okay. All right, so we're going to do this. Now I'm going to get even crazier and start moving some stuff around. Oh, man, I was trying to avoid having this turn into a big thing, but it's going to turn into a big thing. Um, I'll just, I'm going to take the juice and yogurt and just move it over here to the end. All right, we're just going to do that. Ah, and find the pixel. There's like one pixel there. There we go. And just put this empty one right there. Perfect. That's kind of what I wanted. Ah, there it is. Okay. Cheese here. Uh, Gruyere cheese. Right there. Okay. And that is empty. And then this is the cream, and that's going to go here. Creme fraiche. Okay. Yeah, I know creme fraiche. I've, I've heard of creme fraiche. And, um, okay, so that's going to go there. And then what's that? Oh, that's the rice. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So the rice will go there. Oh, shoot. Um, ah, all right, let's, so I'm going to move that pasta down to the bottom shelf. Can I do, nope, that's not that size box. Oh, darn it. Okay, I'll get that fixed. I will find a way to fix that. And that's the other cheese, the Parmigiano Reggiano. Okay, so there we go. Got everything up, and that's good. And we, that, oh yeah, that's the butter. So the butter can go in the back. All right. So many things. All the reorganization going on. Okay. That's, that can now go back. Nothing's going to happen there. And there's that. And I'm going to put those up. So now they'll come back and they'll refill the potatoes. All right, there's that. Now I need a box. What size box was that? It was like one of these. Oh, I don't, oh, yeah, I, no, I can do this. Because I got to order one of everything else out anyway. I got to order everything except the uh, the creme fraiche. So yes, yes, no, yes, 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 yes. All right. There's one of all those. All right. There we go. That's all going to be up there. Oh, one red rose. Hi. How are you doing? Yeah, I see I'm being paged by South Africa. I, I think I know who that is. Um, so, uh, yeah, I, I saw it. Um, what can I do for you? <laughs> I think I know how this is going to be going, but we'll, we'll play along. And, um, all right, so let's set that down there and pull that off of there and put that down there. Yes, I will definitely make sure to set the prices. Absol absolutely. We will do that. Uh, let's get this box thrown away. And, yeah, let's get the rest of this stuff put up. Sorry that this has been taking so long, but uh, we're just kind of, this guy is confused. Oh, oh, he was putting away the potatoes. That's right. I'm like, what is he doing? Um, all right, and then this is the sugar. All right, so we just got, we just about got all this. We're just about there. Whew. It's been a thing. Let us grab our cheeses. So these are going to go here. And that, that's an empty box. So I get to grab that empty box, throw it away. And that's our yogurt, which goes by our other yogurt. That's not where the yogurt is. Oh, uh, did it move? Oh, it moved down here. That's right. It all ended up down here. Okay. And there. All right. And what else we got? Knucklehead, how you doing? Good to see you. How you doing? All right. And that empty box. So now I got everything, and it's all on the shelves, and it's all in the proper places. And so I didn't need that shelf. Um, I might use that shelf for, like, extra toilet paper. Maybe I'll do that, but I'm not going to worry about that right now. So prices. Rice is, wow, $11. Whoa. That's amazing. Uh, sorry, can't do that. Um 250 and there we are and we're gonna go this way and we got our yogurt and I got to go back because I did not 
set the price on the sugar. I walked right by it. So we got this. This is three and a quarter. And there we go. And then all the stuff in here. Oh, my goodness. 20 and a quarter. Everybody buy the creme fraiche. Please buy all the creme fraiche. Six and a quarter. And lastly, but not leastly, seven and a quarter. All done. This guy. No doubt this guy. Absolutely no doubt this guy. <laughs> ah, it's good times. So not yours. Why do you keep doing this? No, I love it. But but again, your your generosity just completely knows no bounds. And 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 again, thank you. I don't know what to keep saying other than the fact that just thank you, thank you, thank you. I and I just feel like I'm repeating myself so much and so badly. Um uh, again, it's it is your last try. Oh, 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 oh you're trying to get Joker. Um, yeah, I don't know how it picks it. I just don't know how it picks it. It's hard to tell. Um, it's, it's got kind of got a mind of its own in terms of how it, it picks people. So, um, okay. That's very interesting. Um, let's, uh, I, I'm, uh, can I, let me see something here. I'm going to, I'm looking outside of my window here. Uh, let me check something out. This might actually go into pause for just a second here. We're, we're going to do something here. Uh, yeah, so it, everything on the screen might be paused. And if it is, it'll be back. Uh, I'm going to go in here. And uh, talk amongst yourselves. I'm, I'm doing some stuff on my end. So uh, let's just take a minute. And we're going to go here. We're, we're going to do Oh, wait. Here. No, we're not going to do that. Uh, that's not going to work. Not going to work. Okay. I was going to try and do something. Didn't happen. So no problem. All right. So now we're back live. Okay. I didn't order that stuff. All right. Let's get that ordered. And let's do that. There we go. I think we got it. Um, yeah, so there's all that. Uh, thank you all for your patience for, for getting everything in the store reorganized. I think we're all, we're good all the way to level 70 at this point in time. Ah, lots of stuff happening. Lots of stuff. Day 196. The store is open for your convenience. Uh, my pronunciation of penne regatta is much better than many foreigners who are living in Italy. Um, oh, wow. I didn't think that that one was that hard to pronounce, but apparently it might be. Um, that just seems like it would be the normal pronunciation, but thank you. All right, so I'm going to have to set another rack here. Yeah, that's going to be for all the other new products that we just got. So that's going to go here. Do I have one more rack? No, I don't. I, I used up all my racks. Okay, I got to buy another rack, uh, furnitures, and small rack, and get that, and bring it in, and there we go, and we're gonna set this here, and uh, yeah, I wish that these things had smaller hit boxes. I really, really do, because the hit boxes on these things are massive. Is it not letting me set it? Why is that not letting me set it there? Is it because I'm in the way? Uh. Is that, how's that for centered? Pretty good. Good enough. All right, let's take all this new stuff and put it up here. So we got some sugar, and we got some penne, and we've got some uh, creme fraiche. So this is going to be the everything. So it's like everything that was on the new product license, basically, is all going to be on this shelf. Um, organizational structure has gone out the window, and that's fine. All I know is that everything that was on this Everything that was on this product license is on this shelf, and I'll go with that, and that's fine. I'm, I'm good with it. I'll make it happen. So, Anna Violet, how you doing? Happy Sunday to you. So glad you're here. And there we go. Now we got a little bit of everything, and I can get, like, one more of everything, too. So let's get one more of everything then. 
while I'm at it because I can hold two boxes of everything. So let us go back to products. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And one round of everything again. It's weird being caught up on all the product licenses. Um, did I read on the penne box where it says it's Italy's number two penne? I wonder what's number one. I did not. Um, it's funny because that is completely a play on Barilla Pasta. Completely a play on it. Um, it's funny that they were actually able to get away with it. <laughs> because that is totally a Barilla Pasta box. Um, but no, I, uh, oh yeah. Number two in Italy. Yeah. It does make me wonder what's number one. I do not know. Um, we will have to go to Italy to find out. And I don't know when that's going to happen, <laughs> but <laughs> if I find out, I will let you know. Okay. Let's see. Um, uh, stats, man, have a wonderful night. Have a wonder or a wonderful afternoon. Have fun watching the NASCAR event and go your favorite driver. Who that may be, whoever that may be. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it'd be nice to be able to wield a, a permanent hammer because uh, sometimes it does get to be a bit much and doesn't need to be that way, but I don't know. At least at least we've got fans. <laughs> no, that, I, no, no that's, that's not the way I meant it at all. Um, not the way I meant that at all. Ah, all right, that goes there. I probably need to get a bunch of toilet paper. Probably a good idea. And I need to check the window chicken because I've not done that. So let's do that. Sloppy Joe, how you doing? Good to see you. Happy Sunday to you. All right, the window chicken's actually looking good. So, oh, um, but these are all empty boxes of it. So this is like one at a time going into the freezer. So let's grab you, put you into the freezer, and then we're just going to go and grab like three boxes and three toilet papers, or four toilet papers. So we're going to get three window chickens. One, two, three. And four toilet papers. It was the old stuff? Yeah. Four of the old and two of the new. So one, two, three, four. Oh, did I get... I got one too many, didn't I? I did. All right, four. And uh, from there... Oh, all the pasta again. Maybe it's the pasta elbows is number one. <laughs> it's hard to say. So, all right. So we got to get one pasta elbows and uh, or all the pasta. So we get that. And then the pasta elbows. So pasta elbows. Where are you? Pasta elbows. Oh, now penne's on here. That's going to definitely mess with my mind having all of that. Um, what else? Yeah, this is going to get difficult having all this here uh okay the powdered sugars and the red flowers let's get one of each of those just in case so sugar and flour and that's the was it that one yeah and it's getting dark in here so once again lights um what else i guess i can get a few mayos and a few hot sauces so let's do that uh, i'll get three mayos three hot sauces and that'll fill that order. Okay. There's that. And back. Uh, I, I think I checked it. Oh, yeah, I did. Um, I don't feel like anyone's been back here to put that in there. So I'm going to do that. And uh, what else? I should probably get the stuff that's out there. Four potatoes. Wow. All the potatoes. Let's grab those. So four potatoes. One, two, three, four. I probably already ordered some, and now I'm going to have more, and that's fine. Um, yeah, so many different kinds of sugar. It's crazy. Okay, yeah, let's get all this put away. And potatoes. And we're going to do a bunch of quick stocking. Back here. Get this all squared away. And hopefully we'll be in good shape. It's getting tougher to navigate back here with those racks back there. It's definitely making it more challenging. Uh, let's run this in, see if we need any. Okay, I can actually put up a box of it. There we go. That's good. Window chicken check complete. Uh, yeah, I ordered two things of potatoes. I ordered two rounds of potatoes. I totally did that. That was totally a thing I did. Um, so we've got this flour. And we got all the other toilet paper. That's window chicken. So it's going to go here. The toilet paper should be over here. 
No, that's more potatoes. Oh, so many potatoes. And where did that toilet paper go? Oh, there it is. Okay, I know I ordered some of it. And so we're going to grab that. There's the other one. Okay, it's always the big boxes. There it is. Okay. Uh, elbows. Got our elbows back. Good to have our elbows back. And out here, yep, more window chicken. Well, let's take a letter look in here, see if we need any more. Yeah, we do. Okay. Just kind of keep it up with it as we put it away. Drop that right there. Perfect. Um, and the, Oh, yeah, more more TP. Awesome. That, I, that actually all worked out perfectly. I must have ordered that twice. <laughs> Oops. Happy accidents. And uh, pasta. It goes there. And, uh, and, oh, yeah, all of our artisanal mayo. Do love our artisanal mayo. It is wonderful stuff. And more. Oh, gosh, I get too many elbows. Once again, I got one too many elbows. I'm going to have to see the doctor about that. And more of our artisanal mayo. And then even more of our artisanal mayo. And then what do we got over here? Oh, yeah, the hot sauce. That's what we got. And I'm going to throw that up there. And that will be that. Okay. Perfect. Huh. Lots happening. <laughs> it's busy. Let's take a look out here. How are we doing? Uh, so, yeah, I now I've got this rack that's kind of pointless. So maybe what I'll do, maybe I'll just double up on all the toilet paper. Maybe. Uh, but then I should have the potatoes over there if I did that. Yeah, I can do that. So maybe that's what I'll do. Maybe I'll have a whole bunch of toilet paper. And we'll do that. So, yeah, that's exactly what I'm going to do. Watch me in action. Watch me go. All right, so this is what we're going to do. I'm going to make this one uh, all of the old toilet paper. So, oh, but i got to get rid of the toilet paper that's on the shelf. So we're going to do this. I'm going to do this a smart way. So I'm going to take these down so they don't come and refill them. So you go over there. I'm going to grab this box. So we're going to have one shelf that's all the old toilet paper, one that's all the new. And then we're going to have all the TP. And then I'm going to move the potatoes and put them on the wall and have all the TP in the middle. So that's what we're going to do. Okay, so now that box is empty. Oh, what am I stuck on? All right, so then let's do the same thing here. Let's grab this box, take it down, and grab that box. And then we're going to set this out here. And I'm going to go... One, two, three, four. So that way they know to refill that. So they'll come out, refill that. And then I can put all this back. So that goes back. That goes back. That goes back. And then I'm going to take this, swing it out. Just set it there at random. I'm going to take this, the giant wall of potatoes. I'm going to take that. I'm going to swing it around. And it's got, like, one pixel it can fit in. Uh, there it is. And then we're going to take this and swing it to this side. Look at us. We've got all the TP, all the potatoes. It's the thing that people have probably been wondering about for a long, long time. We've got it. So, <laughs> ah, that's nice. we got a giant wall of toilet paper and a giant wall of potatoes. We've done it. I am out of dishwasher tablets, and I'm going to probably get dinged, and that's fine, but that's that's where we are. So we are completely out of those dishwasher tablets, and I know that I'm going to get penalized for it. It's all good. So, yeah, so many different kinds of sugar. All the different kinds of sugar. Uh, Cat143 Meow, how you doing? So good to see you. Welcome, my Illinois friend. Glad you're here. Uh, what else do we have going on? What else do I need to order? Uh, is everyone gone? I think everyone's gone. Yeah, everyone's gone. All right, let's get in the next day then. Let's do it. Uh, day 196. Yep. Oh, no. Nobody found. Nobody couldn't find anything. I thought for sure someone was going to say they couldn't find the dishwasher tablets. I thought for sure that was going to happen. Day 196. 82 satisfied. Too grumpy. 
And now we got $9,200 in the bank. So now the next thing I'm going to be saving up for is the ungodly expensive uh, um, expansions. Those are going to be bad. I'm a dog walker. I was returning a dog to one of my clients, and he was drunk, and he told his wife that I was a dog or <laughs> chip, and seven to five are my favorite numbers. Well, that explains it. <laughs> That's you got to love drunk people. You absolutely got to love them. You never know what they're going to do. Okay, TP, powdered sugar, chicken legs, and veal chops. So TP, so this one. So TP, uh, 1950, powdered sugar, um, chicken legs, and veal chops. So I'm going to do the, chi the chicken legs and the veal chops first. So these are, oh, man, down 1075. And uh, the chicken legs. These are 450. These are way down. And then the uh, powdered sugar. Which was it? Not you. Was it you? It was not you. It must have been you. It was. $5. There we go. Um, the Eclipse. Yeah, the Eclipse. Uh, we're not going to have a full one here. We're going to have like a 98.2% full one here. So... That basically means that nothing's going to look that much different other than, like, the shadows. That's about it. So, like, if you look at shadows on the ground, the shadows on the ground are going to look really weird. But aside from that, uh, everything else is going to be the same. So I do remember seeing the full eclipse in 2017, and that was really, really awesome. But up here, we're not going to have a full one. We're going to have an almost full one, but not a completely full one. All right. So, uh, but it'll still be cool. No doubt about it. Um, and everyone who's further south is really going to have a really fun show. Carbondale is going to be hopping. <laughs> it's definitely going to be hopping down there, down in Carbondale. And which flower was that? That was the new flower. That was that one. So if you haven't had a chance to see it, I, mean, I would definitely recommend it. Absolutely recommend it. But, of course, it's not easy for people to just go out and make their way to a solar eclipse. But, or a, a total solar eclipse. But if you did have the opportunity to see it, it is really, really cool. And the fact that it's going to be for like four minutes in some places where you're going to have like four minutes of totality, that must really be cool. Because I don't remember the one in 2017 being that long. It's like it lasted a minute or two and then it was gone. Um, so, yeah, it's... Uh, that's going to be cool, having one that lasts for four-plus minutes. No doubt about it. So if you, are going to be in the, if you are going to be in the path of it, have a wonderful time, and uh, you are really, really going to enjoy it. If you've never seen one before, it's really, really weird. It is really, really weird because it will get to be, like, beyond dusk, and, and all of a sudden, all of the... All of the insects are going to start chirping and the birds are going to stop chirping and everyone's going to get a little weird. And then when it's over, everything will get back to normal. So you're going to have really confused bugs and you're going to have really confused birds. And then four minutes later, everyone will be back to normal. Like what just happened? <laughs> and they won't have any idea. But uh, yeah, I really hope you enjoy it because it is definitely something to experience. No doubt about it. Yeah, we get 98.2%. So, again, 98.2%, you would think that that would mean something, but it, it's still going to be maybe a little bit dark, but not much other than that. So it's only when you're in full totality that it really makes a huge difference. Uh, and one of the tater tots. So let's do that. Oh, uh, going to get some sleep, get ready for WrestleMania. Definitely do that for sure, Joker. Joker. Um, and have a wonderful time watching it. Have a wonderful time. Uh, let's see. Oh, it was the t potato pops. That was the one I needed. So we got toilet paper, green beans, potato pops outside. And what else do we have here? I need a uh, powdered sugar. And we need uh, several steaks. So powdered sugar, a bunch of steaks. So we're going to do this, and that's that one, several steaks. 
So we'll do uh, one, two, three, four of those. And you get 0%. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. Uh, maybe the next one will go through your way. Um, yeah, that's a shame. Uh, eggs. Egg 12s. A couple of those. And then if we look back here, uh, we're still good everywhere there. Oh, a couple of lasagnas. And that's still good. That's still good. So a couple of lasagnas. So let's do that. One, two. And then we'll go from here. So uh, orange juice, a milk, and a couple of red sodas. So a milk. So I'll do that. Or no, is it a couple of milk? No, it was one milk and a couple of orange juice. So one milk. And get that outside. Okay. Then a couple of orange juice and a couple of red sodas. Uh, this feels like it's another one of those days where I'm ordering forever. It really does. Uh, we have days like that every once in a while. Uh, a couple of the old waters. So a couple of those. And then we've got uh, everything there is good. And all the cereals. So let's see that. All the cereals. One, two. One, two. And then two of the honeybees. So two of the honeybees. We'll do that. And then we've got uh, all of the bottom cakes. So six of the bottom cakes. Kibu, how you doing? Good to see you. Happy Sunday to you. Bottom cakes. Let's get four or five of those. Let's get five of them. And then we're going to go here. I am going to get three of the blue rices. So we'll do that. Three of those. One, two, three. They're still all working back here. Okay. I, I feel like I'm being slow, but they're all back here still working. So that makes me feel a little bit better. So four of the soaps and two of the cleaners. So four of the soaps and two of the cleaners. Um, one, two, three, four. No, that's still there. So four of the soaps and two of the cleaners. One, two, three, four. Um, what is the angle of this game? That is an excellent question. <laughs> the angle of this game is is to reach the final level, I guess. I don't know. It's, uh, <laughs> you just, you just kind of keep growing and growing. And yeah, it's just kind of the joy of the building and the management. That's really it. Aside from that, it's not, it, it's kind of like trying to reach level 100 and finally reaching the final boss is really kind of what it is. Um, but aside from that, yeah, it's a it's a game that is very very simple in its concept, but it is also extremely addictive at the same time. It's uh it's it is a weird phenomenon. Um, but yeah, I I hope that helps to explain it a little bit. Uh, Jesper, how you doing? So good to see you. Such progress on this game. Keep on dam gaming from Denmark with love. Thank you so much for that, Jesper. Yeah, we are definitely making progress. We're all the way up to level 67. We are just continuing to grow a little bit more and more. We've got um, we've got all the product licenses now that we can get. The next ones come at level 70. Level 70, we get to open up a bookstore. Um, well, we get books. So, no, we don't open up a bookstore, but we get books. So that'll be kind of cool. I'll get to join all the cool kids that have books in a few levels. Nowhere to put them but I'll have bookstores. I'll have books. So that's a thing to look forward to somewhere down the road. And, uh, yeah, so we're going to try and get all this done. We're going to see when the Stalker Boys stop because they, they are still going, and that kind of bewilders me that they are still going. Um, when will they get a car care center? <laughs> you never know with these devs. They've got plenty of space on the street as to what they can do. Um, and it will be interesting to see what they do at because they might add all kinds of stuff. You never know. The end goal is just the end. That, that is, that is pretty much the case. It's, uh, you just, you, you keep going and you just keep on, uh, getting more and more stuff, getting more and more expansions. And eventually it's like the biggest thing. It's kind of like, yeah, I don't have a good comparison. It's just kind of like a, a game where you just kind of keep keep building 
Yeah, and it's it's I mean it's a really good game if you like just designing your own space. So if you're into games where you can design your own area and design your own space, then this is right kind of in that same kind of thing, in that same kind of genre, I would say. Because everyone's space looks completely different from everybody else's space, and you just you you kind of take a blank space and completely make it your own. And that's kind of what we've got. Um, all right. So are they? They're still out here. Wow. They they are still all working. This is this is weird. They're they're normally done long before this. I feel like I've been doing this for a half hour, and I know I haven't been, but it certainly feels like it. And none of the stocking crew is is out front standing by the stoop yet. Um. Yeah, and yeah, seeing the all of you guys with the with the channel, seeing the subscriber count go up again, that is all completely because of you, um, and it, it's it's so exciting to see. And I, again, I I owe all of you eternal gratitude for for constantly helping that that subscriber count go up. Um, it is really exciting, and I I love seeing where it's going, and I'm very excited to see how it's gonna. How things are going to keep rolling as time goes on. I am really, really excited to see how things are going to keep going because it's it's exciting times. It really, really is, um, as you can tell by me putting stuff on all the wrong shelves. Um, so yeah, again, thank you guys all for that, um, for everything that you do, for helping us to keep growing every day. It really is awesome. They are still not done. Wow, they are still not done. Um, love the basic nature and progression of this game. Really enjoying the stream. Thank you so much, Luke Shave. I appreciate that. Uh, that is very nice of you to say. How much is the new expansion? The new one is 40000 That is my next new expansion. If we go here, management, uh, bills. How are you doing, Bill? Uh, growth, $40,000 is my next one. 40 Gs. Um, so, yeah, it's kind of spendy. That's the next one. Uh, so, yeah, it's a lot of cash. So we will get there. All right, finally, the stalker crew is starting to make their way to the street. Definitely starting to make their way to the street. So we will, once they're all out here, we're going to get the day started. Um, two of them are out here, and we will wait for the other two. And once they're out here, we'll get going. Um, we have three of them out here now. And just one more. Who's missing? Oh, I put something out in that that distracted somebody. Sorry, Max. Didn't mean to distract you by putting out a new product. That's my bad. Uh, come on out. We'll, we'll get the day going. Uh, just come back out. And, uh, yeah, so Matt is back there putting away a product that I just got. He's putting away the, uh, the bottom cakes. So once he's back, we'll get this rolling. Extra toilet paper, of course. Why not? So <laughs> a little bit extra TP. Never hurt anybody. Are you back, Matt? Oh no, that's fine. I'm not going to I'm not going to stop. Day 197? 6? One of those? The store is open for your convenience. Does anybody remember what day it is? I think it's 197. I don't know. I think it's 197. I'm pretty sure it's 197. I'm going with that. Yeah, I felt like we were on 196 before. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's where we are. Okay. So, yeah, now all we got to do is just save up $40,000. That's not hard. It's just $40,000. It's no big deal. No, 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 nothing. Nothing huge there. <laughs> it's, that'll only take a while. And, uh, yeah, and hopefully we'll have that before we hit level 70. Because at this point, I wouldn't mind if the levels slowed down a little bit. Just that way they gave me more time to trigger, try and figure out where I was going to put more products. Um, that goes there. Yeah, 197. Thank you, Lady Fluffy. Um, that's where I thought we were. I really did. And finally, the last of the bottom cakes. Okay, now I need all the top cakes. So that's where we are now. So got all the bottom cakes, but now we need all the tops. So let's do that. Get those all in here. Working on expansion 18. Man, it's a lot of expansions. Um, or actually, well, what am I on? Which one am I on? Um, where are we in the world of expansions? Uh, 13. Oh, wow. You're on 18. Whew. Whoa. 
That would be crazy. 18. Um, yeah, as long as the music isn't copyrighted. That was the other thing that blew me away. So getting back to Center Station Simulator, um, that was a, that was kind of a nightmare because I, I was up way too late last night um, getting that video edited and ready to go. And I wake up this morning and it tells me, oh, yeah, your video is not going to be monetized because it has copyrighted music in it. And I'm like, what? What's going on here? And I look and the music that's in the game, the music that the developer used in the game is copyrighted. <laughs> so then I had to go in and have YouTube mute the music. And I didn't expect that out of like an indie de developer game that they'd use copyrighted music. Now, if I was playing like WWE 2K24, then yeah, that's obviously going to be copyrighted music. But in some little game by some little developer, I did not a think, not at all think that there was going to be copyrighted music in there that I was going to lead me to have a video that would potentially be demonetized unless I took some action. Um, so that was the first time I ran into that as an, as an, as an issue. Um, thankfully I was able to get it edited in time and we only had to delay the, um, delay the premiere by an hour, but that completely threw me when that happened. Um, I just uh, like, oh, okay, what did I do wrong? And that was what it was. It wasn't anything I did. It was what the game did. So yeah, did not expect that at all. But at least I know for now that when I do my next uh, video of that, which is going to be the live stream on Monday, make sure I've got the music turned completely off. 100% <laughs> off. No music for that game. It's not going to happen, which is fine. Okay, so we got some bleaches. And get this put away. And yeah, I feel like my... <laughs> I feel like my head's spinning. Not not in real life, just but with everything that's going on in the game here. There's a lot that's a lot that's going on here, trying to keep a lot organized and sorted. And I gotta check these two middle shelves because these are definitely blind spots for me. Yeah, I don't know why they do that either. That is the first game I've had where that's happened. I have not had that happen in any other game I've played. And I I've I've played a number of them now. And that was the first time that that happened. And it just, it really confused me because I'm like, why would, why would I have gotten a copyright notice? And th that was why. So I don't know. It, it, yeah. You would think that they wouldn't want to do that because it definitely doesn't help to have people show off your game when you've got copyrighted music in it. So uh, maybe it's just because they weren't thinking anymore about it or they just didn't think it would be a big deal. Maybe they thought they could get away with it. Uh, it's, it was definitely strange, no doubt. So one of those flowers, click, and get that ordered. And then one more of those flowers and two of those flowers. Huh. Now what? Uh, sushi. Large sushi and small sushi. So two large and one small. There, there, there. Let's do that. We're getting close to the time. Happy Sunday, Marissa. How you doing? Good to see you. And lights! There it is. Let's grab some of these products, put them in. Now, that can go up now. And, oh, I have not checked the window chicken. Let us check the window chicken. How are we doing? Uh, that's the big one. All right, let's check our window chicken. I'm sure it's empty. I have no doubt. Oh, no, there's still some there. Perfect. All right, let's grab some. And grab that one, put it up. Window chicken in the freezer. And one more. Does one of these have two in it? No, they both got one. So that's the way we're going to go. And there it is. And let's see. I should probably do one more last order here before I run out of time. So let's get the window chickens. One, two, three. And let's see. Anything else? Yes, you were, Marissa. It happened. That can happen. So welcome to the Rusty Champagne Club. Glad you're here. Hope you enjoy all the membership benefits. Uh, water, the right water. And uh, a cleaner, one of the cleaners. And uh, what else? Uh, I need a dishwasher tablet. Yeah, so a dishwasher tablet and another one of the cleaners and a couple of the kegs. So dishwasher tablets, 
and a couple of the cleaners, or one of the cleaners, and a couple of the kegs, or the beer six packs. It was that. There we go. That's the last order. That's what we're going to do. So, yeah, I, I, I think that they were trying to figure that out, whether or not Joker was following, um, whether or not he had it available on this channel. So, because heaven knows, I mean, it was, yeah, it, it, it seemed like at some point luck would have hit him. Um, so I think that that might have been the issue. So they were they were definitely looking into that, I know. See if that might have been the thing. Uh, Katrina, how you doing? Have a great day. Um, have fun doing adult things. Adulting is hard. It really is. So have fun on your phone. <laughs> um, and thank you for being here, even on your phone. That's dedication. Okay. So we're going to get the rest of this put away. The store is closed. How we doing? We're doing pretty good here. Oh, and window chicken is there. And we're going to set that there. And we got the, um, got that there. So, and our cleaners. And that's going to go there. Oh, and our pen A. Okay, yeah, now I got to remember where all these are. That's going to confuse me. Um, I'll, I'll, I'll get it eventually, but all these new products, it's like, oh, yeah, those go on that new rack. i got to remember that now. I hate it. When, that's the worst part about getting new products. It's like, okay, where did those go again? Where did I set this? And just trying to keep that in mind. Okay, let's check on Window Chicken again. Okay, that works. Get those out there and set that right there for seasoning. That works. And here's our... This is our, uh, that's that sushi. That's right. That's that one. All the products still in the street. I should probably grab those boxes out of the street. Let's do that. <laughs> we got the flour. Whoa. That's going to go there. And then, oh, yeah, the big kegs right there. And we've got, oh, the other box of penne. The number two pasta in the world or in Italy, and we'll never know what's number one. <laughs> It'll never be known. Um, flour does not go here. Flour goes here. And then what do we got? We got the vodka right up there. Oh, man, so many boxes. And two more. And that's all we got. There's that. And one more. It's the flour. And then that is probably another flour. <laughs> I almost got run over by the car. Was not even expecting that, but almost got run over by the car. Uh, crazy one TMC. How you doing? Happy Sunday to you. So glad to see you. Okay. All the water. Have I ever been on the radio in Chicago? In another life, I would have loved to have been a DJ. In another life, I would have loved to have done it. When I was in high school, I actually was in the uh, the broad, uh, there was a broadcasting class, and the the high school had its own radio station, and I was I was going to be a DJ on the high school radio, and they changed the format of the radio station to be all progressive rock, and this is back when groups like um, Green Day Green Day was like brand new back then. And I really had no interest whatsoever in playing progressive rock. And so I decided not to be a radio DJ on the high school radio station because I was young and stupid and didn't want to play progressive rock. I wanted to play my the other stuff instead. And so I never ended up doing that. Um, but yeah, in another life, I would have thought about being a DJ. I don't know how well it would have paid, but I would have absolutely loved it. But now I get to do this, and this is the next best thing. So that's that's... It's just as good, if not better. I would say it's probably even better, if I if I had to say. It's probably even better. Uh, milk six-packs and moussaka and, yeah, so milk six-packs, moussaka, and apple juice. And then I got the stuff that I got to order in big uh, numbers. So milk six-packs and moussaka and uh, orange juice. Was it orange juice? No, it's apple juice. Whew, glad I looked at that again. Almost ordered the wrong juice. And then one more thing. Uh, a uh, toilet paper. 
and that one. Well, thank you so much for that, Humble Pie, for that lovely comment. It's always when they tell me that I got a face made for radio that I've really got to wonder. Because I hear that one a lot, too, and I don't know how to react to it. Day 197. Perfect day. Love it. 81000 599 7450 in income, 9700 in the bank. There you go. Yeah, classic rock would be great. Hello, I'm Rusty Champagne, and you're listening to 97.1 WDRV-FM, The Drive. I would have loved that. That would have been great. Not to be. Instead, I get to do accounting. <laughs> potatoes, beer, Blondale, mashed potatoes, and I didn't see the fourth one. Uh, potatoes and five and a quarter. Uh, beer, Blondale, mashed potatoes. So if someone saw the fourth thing that I needed to change the price on, and if you want to call it out, I would appreciate it because um, I did not see it. Beer, Blondale. Uh, the beer, that's over here. That right all the way over here now. Um, this is three and a quarter. Yeah, <laughs> that was epic. <laughs> and uh, what were what was the other thing? Um, let's see. Uh, I'll look it up. What was it? Oh no! Oh, I got to go here and pay the bills anyway. Bill, hello. Get you all squared away. And uh, so smooth. <laughs> um. I wouldn't have been like I wouldn't have been able to be like a, a wacky morning zoo guy like that. That wouldn't have worked. So, hey, Rusty Champagne here. Welcome to Z ninety five. Hey, no, that wouldn't have been me. I couldn't have done that. Um, uh, what am I doing? Market. That's what I'm doing. Um, and going to this. And so let's see. Scrolling down the list. What was it? Because I, I got three, I missed the fourth one. And there's so many products now. I did the potatoes. I uh, did the beer Blondale. I did the mashed potatoes. What was the one that was down? Where's the door? Um, what was it? Is it way down here? It was the chicken legs. That's right. It was the chicken legs. Ah, all the way down there. Bark, chicken legs. Um, you are down and you are four bucks. All right. There it is. Um, and now coming up for you, we have Twilight Zone by Golden Earring here on 97.1 The Drive. Uh, <laughs> uh, okay. Sandwich bread. And we'll get sandwich bread and milk six packs here. On 97.1. All right. Uh, that is actually a radio station in Chicago. Um, I didn't just make that one up. Um, milk six packs and bread. Sandwich bread. So sandwich bread and milk six packs. Got those and those. <laughs> oh, thank you, Rob Evans. That's so nice of you to say. Uh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Stretch. Yes. Oh, stretch. Definitely. Oh, I definitely needed that. Uh, oh, I've got stuff sitting outside. Ah, forgot about that. Would have ordered all kinds of double stuff, and that would have been bad. It's a great cookie, though, double stuff, but you don't want it in your stock room unless it's the actual cookie. Then you want it. Let's grab all this, bring it in, and, man, it's dark outside. It must be so cloudy. Um, yeah, I'm glad I didn't order moussaka. I was getting ready to, and then like, wait, I thought I ordered that, and it's because I did. That is moussaka, right? Yes, it is. Okay, I want to make sure of that. So that was it. Uh, does coffee count as hydration? Of course it does. It's got water in it. I mean, that counts. I mean, it's like chocolate cake counts as a breakfast food. It's got eggs. It's got flour. It's got milk. I mean, that counts. Purple's a fruit, so... That, that it all counts. Mm, purple. So I got pasta. I'm slap happy. I'll admit it. You got a little more pasta. And some more pasta. All the carbs. Everyone in their carbs. Let's do it. I got to turn on the lights in my own room. I cannot even see what's going on here. Ah! All right. In my own office. Lights! You couldn't tell that I turned them on, but I did. You'll have to trust me. Okay. All right. Back into my chair. Uh, you'll have to show me pictures of your store. I would love to see them. 
Definitely have to show me. Um, you can send pictures in Discord. Uh, there's a, probably a place where you can, can shoot them off there. All right, let's get some stuff ordered because that is the point of this is actually order some product and stuff. So sugar, uh, we'll get four of those. What else do I have on this order? It's not sugar. Um, do I have a milk six pack down there? I do. So drop that. And uh, let's go around. I can get a few more veal chops. Let's do that. Man, I ran out of veal chops. It took that. It took forever for that to happen. But we'll do that. A fat pancake. Um, a fat pancake. I missed something there. <laughs> but a fat pancake sounds good. Believe you me. All right, blue cheese and green cheese. Let's get five of each of those. So cheese, blue, and four more of those. So one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five. That takes care of all that, and then I need all the chicken legs. Oh, and some new cheese and some, yeah, so we'll get four new cheese, and we'll get uh, five of the chicken legs. So there, and one, two, three, and chicken legs. One, two, three, four, five. There's that. Go around this way. I need a potato. And uh, that's about it there. So I'll get a potato. And then let's go here. Everything here. I can get a cereal. Uh, nope, you're going to bring it back. So I don't need a cereal. Everything's good here. Good here. Good here. A couple of kegs. So we'll do that. So a couple of kegs. One, two. So one, order, two, back this way, uh, we need some, oh, that's the original pizza. So pizza original, pizza cheddar. So we're going to do this, uh, pizza mixed, one, two, pizza cheddar, one, there it is, to the max. Have a good Eclipse Day as well. Thank you very much. Take care of yourself. Um, three, new toilet paper, one old one. One, two, three, one. Back around this way, I need two of the ice creams. I need one of the ice creams. <laughs> they always do that to me, uh, that ice cream. And one of each of the bleaches. So one of each of the bleaches. Bleach, one, two. Oh, no, that's full. One. Over here good there. Oh, I can get a wine. There's only one wine in that box. Let's get a wine. One. And over here, um, I can get, uh, what do I need? I can get one of those sugars. I can get a bunch of that rice and a bunch of that cheese. So sugar, it's one of you. Uh, a bunch of the new rice. So we're going to go one, two, three, and some of that new cheese. The even newer cheese, one, two, three, four. So get all that. And now what? Uh, that cheese. There's so much cheese now. I can't even go red cheese, blue cheese, green cheese, new cheese anymore. Because now there's just tons of cheese. It's like I'm running a cheese shop here. Okay. I think that's it. So let's do all that. And they're still busy stocking. That is crazy. Absolutely crazy. All right, so let's get this stock while the stocker crew is doing their thing. And then we will get the day rolling once they're all out, outside standing on the stoop ready to sing a song. Nope, that doesn't go there. That goes there. So in case you missed it earlier, in case you were not here, hi. And tomorrow we are going to be doing a live stream of Center Station Simulator at 4.30 p.m., Central Daylight Time. That will be our Monday live stream, Center Station Simulator. That wonderful, wacky game um, with the abandoned supermarket, now called the Rusty Cart, out in the middle of the desert where people can come visit, but delivery trucks are not allowed. So that is going to be the live stream that we do tomorrow. We are going to try all of it out. I'm not even going to try and do anything in advance to try and cheat. We are just going to pick it up from where we left off. We're going to see what other kind of crazy stuff occurs in the game, live and in person, tomorrow, 4.30 p.m., Central Daylight Time. So if you are... Did, did the Discord channel link expire again? I know that I've changed that. And I know that I said it to not expire. 
I know I did. I absolutely know I did. That thing must, it must be a lie that it says that it doesn't expire. I don't know why it keeps doing that because I know I said it did not expire. Discord is a lie. I'm telling you that. So I guess I will have to change it once again because I've changed it a bunch of times and I always say, please do not expire the link. And it does. So that's rather rude of it that it keeps doing that. So I will I will work on getting that fixed. Um, Cheese Factory Simulator. That would be a good game. Absolutely would be a good game. So, yes, for those of you who would love to see some more Center Station Simulator, um, we will be doing that tomorrow at, um, oh, you're not that cheese. You're that cheese. 4.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Um, it is a weird game. It's weird in all the best ways. I, I Like I said, I think that game's got some real potential. It's just... It starts out, oh, man, it's going to rain. I just heard some thunder here. Um, it just it starts out rather wacky, and the tutorial on it definitely needs a little bit of work, and the fact that they don't have all the key bindings set up properly at the beginning is also a bit of a head-scratcher. But once you peel away those layers of the onion, oh, it does work. Okay, perfect. Um, all right, okay, cool. Um, so, yeah, once you peel away the layers of the onion, it is, uh, I think there's something there, and I'm definitely going to keep on trying it to see what we've got there because there feels like there's something there. And I, I want to see what else it's got. I want to see what else it's got to it. Um, tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. Uh, for the pre recorded episode, so not live, the pre recorded episode, we will have the pre recorded episode of, uh, of Country Life. Countryside Life, that game, uh, because there was new content that came out right after my episode posted. Of course it did. So, yeah, tomorrow morning, 8 a.m., we will have the uh, new content of Countryside Life. And, again, that will be pre-recorded. I will be in the chat for a while, but um, it will not be live. It will be pre-recorded at 8 a.m. So those will be things to look forward to for your viewing pleasure. Hope you will be able to stop by and check them out. All right. Three of the four are out here. So we're going to get this going. Uh, day 198. The store is open for your convenience. Let's make it happen. I think we got one more day. I think we can go to day 199. And I know that everyone's like, please go to 200. But I've, I've, got, a, I've got other stuff that I unfortunately have to take care of. So we'll, I think we're going to be able to make it to 199. So we'll get one more after this, and uh, and we'll go from there. So just so, no, that's not down there. That's up there. I'm like, what what goes down there? Nothing. Absolutely nothing goes in that space. Not a thing. Um, yeah, that's that cheese. All right, so we're gonna get that, and uh, then we're going to get this. Uh, does it turn into funyun? I mean, there funyuns are a thing here. Um, does it turn into fun? Well, Funyuns are like a, a snack. They're, they're, it's like a, 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 how do you even describe Funyuns? If you were to describe Funyuns, how would you describe Funyuns? That's an interesting question. Um, yeah, they're, they're a tasty onion flavored snack, <laughs> but I don't know how else, how else to describe more than that. But yeah, maybe it does turn into a Funyun. But yeah, I mean, I did, like I said, I did do two. Vi- I did do two takes of that game, and the first one will be lost forever to time. Um, but the second one went a lot better. And yeah, it's just a, it's a shame that the tutorial is a little bit janky. Um, but hopefully they will fix that because I'm sure they're going to get plenty of feedback saying, "Hey, your tutorial needs a lot of work." Um, and once they get that, then I think that that's going to lead to some possibly better things. So, yeah, onion chips. I think that that's, um, yeah, they're not even fake onions that are fried. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, you've heard of onions, right? I think so. I would, maybe. Um, yeah, they're, you, can, you can buy them at the store. They're in the section with all the chips and stuff. So they come in like a yellow bag with green lettering on them. They are pretty tasty. They're not at all good for you, but they're pretty tasty. So, so they got that going for them. Um, what time is it? Wow, it's already noon in the game. In game time, it's already noon, that is. Okay. All the veal. Put that all up there. 
and more veal. Let's put that up there. Whoa, did that actually go in the right spot? Did I, like, sling that? Oh, wow, I thought I slung that into a wrong space. It was like a Matrix move. All right, let's put that there. And, yeah, Funyuns. Those are them, Funyuns. F-U-N-Y-U-N-S. That is the ones. Good old Funyuns. Um, yeah, a, a tasty... A tasty treat. That's there. That's that one. And sugar. Right about there. And then we've got more cheese. Man, all the cheese. Again, Cheese Factory Simulator. That would be a game. I am also looking forward to whenever Chocolate Factory Simulator comes out. And I will promise that I won't call it Chocolate Family Simulator. Because um, that game, I, I really like that one. I don't know when it's coming out. have no idea. Um, no details, but you can guarantee that whenever it does come out, we will have content on that here um, whenever that does happen. So looking forward to that one for sure um, whenever it happens. Chips. One, two. And uh, Twilight Butterfly Pig. Hey, how you doing? Good to see you. Happy Sunday. Glad you're here. Uh, and one bottle of work down. One bottle of work. One bottle of water down. Words are once again hard. Uh, that happens every once in a while. Uh, beer. Uh, it was that one. And a few of those. So we got that. Uh, looking around the room, I can get a couple more of those rice. So we'll do that. A couple of those. One, two. And there. And now what can we do? A keg, a couple of toilet papers, and a new toilet, or a couple of old toilet papers, and a new one. So a keg, a couple of, oh, I forgot which one it was. A couple of new and an old one. I don't know why I always forget that. A couple of new and an old. And how about other stuff? I already ordered the chips. Uh, I think I'm good. I'll get a few salmon. Why not? We'll do a few salmon. And I have not checked the window chicken in forever. All right, let's do that. What else can I get? Two more things. Uh, bleaches. I'll get a couple of bleaches. I'll get one of each. So one, two. Get that ordered. Run up here. Run over to the light switch. Lights! And run through here. Check the window chicken. And Atomic Man, how you doing? Good to see you. So I run right past you. Zip. All right, grab a box of window chicken. Throw this on the shelf. There we go. All is well. And, whoa, I'm taking that box with me. I don't know where it's going, but it's coming with me wherever we're going. And put that up and grab that one. And let's run all this. What, how are we doing on time? 620. Wow, that's a lot of loud thunder out there. That explains why it's so dark. Now I know. Um, I think we're going to be okay. I think we're going to be fine. So, but, yeah, we've definitely got a little bit of a... Uh, a little bit of a storm getting ready to roll through here, here in Champagne land. So we will be on the lookout for that. Um, and then tomorrow it's supposed to be like 70 degrees, finally, again. <laughs> Not that I'm complaining about the cold weather from last week, which I am. But, uh, yeah, now it's raining. Now I hear it raining. So, but hopefully it's going to be fine. I'm actually going to go out here and I'm going to open up the blinds and see what it looks like. So let's do that. Again, you can't see me doing this, but I'm opening up the blinds. And let's see what it looks like out here. Yeah, it's coming down pretty good. So hopefully we'll be fine, fingers crossed, that nothing will go wrong and everything will be fine. Okay. Uh, and, of course, doing that, I lost a bunch of time, but that's all right. It's important to know what the weather's like outside. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, what else did I possibly not order that I might need to order if I look here? Um, what else is possibly out that I don't think I got any of that flour. And even if I did, no, I'm not going to be able to get it in time. I'm not going to be able to get it. Uh, no, I just missed. Just missed. I was so close. So close. <laughs> I hugged and squeezed and pet. I will hug him and squeeze him and I will name him George and I will love him. I remember that. That was good old days right there. All the good times from the past. Uh, 
<laughs> Good going. New keyboard inbound. Uh, uh, what else do we have out here? Oh, yeah, all the salmon. That's what we got. And salmon and beer. That's a good combo. And rice. Salmon, beer, and rice. There it is. Now it's lightening up again. So apparently it was just a real quick a real quick hitter of a storm right through here. Nothing too bad. As far as we're concerned, that's that's like nothing. So it's all good. All right, nine o'clock. We're back over ten thousand dollars. So I'm twenty five percent of the way to the next expansion. That's it. Another seventy five percent to go. That's all. We just need another thirty thousand uh, dollars. No big deal. That that's that can be done in many days. <laughs> I did not get any of that new flower. I thought they were, but I or I thought I did, but I did not. Let's take a look up here. Um, all right, we can use some of this bleach because they're doing their own thing. So I'll help them out here. So I'm going to go this way. And I'll fill, I'll fill from this side. They can fill from the other side. And we'll get everything done. Uh, hand soap. Let's get one of those. And that's all the hand soap we got. So I will order a bunch of hand soap then. All right. Because that is now gone. So let's get a few hand soaps. So we're going to go here. Hand soap. I know I need that. And... We need a couple of the new bleaches because I put all that up. So we'll do that. And what else? Um, probably, oh, yeah, I got the hand soap. <clears throat> probably need a couple of bug cleaners. So let's clean those bugs. It's been a while since we cleaned the bugs. Have not done that in a while. <laughs> um, could not have mis misspelled that more. Um Oh, I didn't see anything yet misspelled, but maybe it's... <laughs> uh, what do we got? Um, oh, all the toilet paper. Scrap all the TP. Put all this up. All the spots. I love the way that some people order from, like, the top shelf of the toilet paper and others order from, like, the middle and then some from, like, the the bottom. It's like the, the stuff on the top is, like, freshest or something. I, I don't know why they do that, but it's kind of humorous. All right, you grabbed an olive oil, so I won't grab that. You just took that. Um, dishwasher tablets. Do I have any up there? No. Uh, how about the next ones down? I don't need them. How about cleaner? Uh, I do have some of that. Let's grab that. And put that up. There we go. Three of them in there, of course. And we'll throw that away and grab the other one. And that, I think, only had like six in it. So... Uh, all right. So, oh, I got one bottle left. Of course I do. So, all right, we'll throw that in there. And do I even have any room left in the order? Uh, no, I don't. And I think they're done up here. Yes, everyone has gone home. Top, sh top shelf toilet paper is the lightest. That makes more sense. Now I understand. Now I get it. If I send you some rain, can you send us some heat? <laughs> that sounds like a fair trade. Okay, checking my eyelids for holes. <laughs> <laughs> from the inside always okay day 198 87 000. perfect we love it 607 points we're up to 12730 dollars okay we got one more day in us we can do one more let's make it happen one more time um ham and mashed potatoes so ham and mashed potatoes so ham or mashed potatoes, five bucks. Ham. It's like the lunch meat ham. That is over here. And now that's five dollars. Okay. Now it's very bright outside. So still cloudy, but much brighter. And all right, what do we need to order? Let us do this and try and do it. Uh oh, let's grab all this stuff that we got first. And bring that in. Okay. Uh, hurricane season. Ooh, yeah, hurricane season's not fun. Don't have to worry about that around here. We just got to worry about tornadoes. And even then, it doesn't seem like we're that bad around here anymore in that regard. But, uh, yeah, we're, we're, if a hurricane hits here, we're in trouble. <laughs> Something has gone horribly wrong if that happens. But, yeah, those are not to be trifled with, that's for sure. All right, got all the hand soap. Oh, 
put that there and more and we'll put that there and a little more put that there there it is and then what was this this was oh yeah this is the new flower that i almost thought i ran out of but magically we somehow did not and that was only good fortune that we did not run out of it because everybody loves baking in this town everybody loves it. you did make it time you did make it back in time did the coffee date go good um hopefully it did or maybe it didn't because you're here back in time so yeah but we're we, we're in the final day we're getting the final day getting ready to go here uh in a bit so yes you are just in time okay uh it's red flowers blue flowers powdered sugar so one two and flowers one two one two that's that and uh then we're gonna go here and everything there is good everything here is good oh i'm gonna get a few of the of the red cheese so one two three four and that's that order okay that's done let's go around this way um everything good there i need a couple of apple juice a potato so apple juice and a potato so two apple juice and a potato and one of those there we go and then we're gonna go around this way i need a couple of hummus so one two we'll do that oh awesome that's good to hear awesome great news always good to have a good day that's for sure congratulations hope everything continues to go better with it or continues to be good with it not go better be good don't pay any attention to me i don't know what i'm talking about uh, just uh, yeah, just, just talk about yourself. <laughs> I'm just kind of, I'm saying words and they're random and that's, it's what it normally is with me. So <laughs> you've come to expect it by now for me. I say stuff that does not make sense. Okay. Pasta, pasta elbows. Get that up here. Uh, we're good all the way there. I need those dishwasher tablets. That's right. So I need two of those for sure. So two of those. And then we're going to go around this way, uh, get a bunch of shampoos. So we'll get four shampoos. One, two, three, four. Uh, we need a words are hard emote. We definitely need a words are hard emote. Most definitely. Words are so darn hard. They're unbelievably hard. I don't know why they are, but they are. And it's just, they, they are confounding in their difficulty. Absolutely confined, confounding. Hey, Kite, how you doing? Good to see you. Happy Sunday. Um, a keg, a couple of toilet papers. So we got a keg, the, that one. And a couple of toilet papers. And it was the old ones. I actually remember that this time. A couple of the other ice creams. I think these are ice cream vanilla. Yeah. So the maxi cones. All right. So now I think we're good. I think I've gone around. Um... On it, coming soon. I knew I could count on you, Yoda. I knew it. As always. As always. Much love to Yoda. Um, two wines and a keg of this kind. And how about over here? Uh, another penne, because, again, everybody loves pasta in this place. Not posta. Pasta. Posta is a completely different thing. I don't even know what it is. So... Stamp it on my forehead. <laughs> I know the feeling. Absolutely know the feeling. Very, very much so. I mean, they're all in there. I mean, the words are all in there. They just eventually come out wrong order in the. And that's the way it is. It's like the movie Robin Hood Men in Tights. Over that boy hand. It's It's just like that. It's the exact same thing, and uh, it's it, but it's what makes everything so much fun. I mean, because if if it was if everything came out in the right order, that'd be boring. I mean, anyone can say words in the right order. It takes a real master to say things and get it all completely backwards and wrong. That's that's how you know that you got something good going on. Post is what you make for a school project. <laughs> that's yeah, that's what you do when you're a little kid. You, you take all the pasta, and you put it on a piece of paper, and it's posta. It's the exactly that. Um, words are hard. 
uh, yeah, that's even funnier because it's missing an O. That I think that that adds to the uh, <laughs> we're men in tights. Yes, that that adds to the funniness of it. I think the the humor even. You know, the word that's humor, but is funniness instead. That word. Um, Because after all, words are hard. So we're going to keep putting this stuff away. Um, Yeah. Good thing about living in Ontario is you don't have anything. Yeah. You you don't have any of that stuff, but it also does not get warm (laughs) all that often. Um, I would love to visit Ontario sometime. Um, would really love to visit it because I hear that Ontario is beautiful, but I have not been there other than on a layover. Uh, I was in Toronto once on a layover, and that's the only time I've ever seen Toronto was the inside of their airport, and that was all. So, um, But, yeah, I would love to visit Ontario sometime. And what do we got? Words are hard. Yeah, they are definitely hard. Are they still stocking? It feels like they're still stocking. Um, I'm going to get as many of these boxes taken care of as I can, and then we're going to get this final day rolling here. And we'll see how we're doing at that point in time. But they have been, these guys, man, Matt, Max, Mark, and Marv, they have been hauling it. They have been busting it for sure. They have not had a dull moment this entire stream. Not at all. It's just been nonstop for them the entire time and i'm surprised that i've not run into these racks in the middle here because you would think for sure that i would have hit them but i somehow have avoided them crispy chibi man i haven't talked about crispy chibi this entire stream i feel bad it's my crispy chibi it's my favorite cereal and i've not talked about it but yeah they're they're still going and i am still taking care of everything bad weather bros um, we've got a few more things here. I'm getting to the point where I'm going to run out of boxes, uh, which makes me almost wonder if I need to be ordering more. But I think I'm okay. Oh, no, you don't go there. You go there. Um, what is that? Oh, that's the cereal. Yeah. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, that's the elbows. All right, elbows right there. Elbows out. And more flour. Um, I wonder if maybe they're just slowing down. I wonder. No, Matt, Max, Mark, and Marv couldn't possibly be slowing down. There's no chance of that. No chance. I know they're busy, and I know they work hard. Um, They work hard for the money. So hard for it, honey. They do work hard for the money, so you better treat them right. Um, And we got hummus. So just two more things. Got some crispy chibi. And, okay, so I got to get some of the other cereal. Okay, so I've got everything of mine up, and they're still going. Okay, all right. So what else do I need to order then since they're still going? And I will just get it ordered and then put it up as they're still doing their things. So we'll get a few salts. I need a couple of egg. Uh, you need a few egg eights, an egg 12 and an egg 4. So a few of those, one, one. And what else do I need over here? Uh, I need a couple of white label sodas and a couple of zaps. So sodas, uh, one, two, and click, and that, and zaps, one, two. And then we're going to go around again. I need um, the uh, brown label cereal, one, two. And we're going to go around... And a vodka up there. So we need one of those. Not V vodka. That's a different thing as well. And uh, the salt and pepper are both right down there in that spot right down there. Um, the potato pops. That's what's up there. Potato pops. One, two. And I think we're good. Okay. These guys are... I, I, they've got to be close to being done by now. They've got to be absolutely close to be done by now. It's supposed to be 76 in Philly on Tuesday because why not? Exactly. It's just the weather, Midwest weather. If you don't like it, just give it a minute, even though Philadelphia is not technically in the Midwest. Um, but, yeah, it's, that's the way the weather is around here. It's just it's what you get. Okay, we're, we're going to get the day rolling. I, I'm sure that these guys are going to be done here pretty soon. Uh, they've 
got to be close to being done. And if not, I'll help him out. Fred, you ready? We got one more day here. We got one more to go. Let's make it happen. Uh, Frank, I know you guys have been busting a lot of hump today. So uh, good job. We got one more to go. Fritz, one more. You got one more in you? I know you do. Franz, how about you? Man, that's a weird shadow back there. Uh, that's weird. Huh. Along that wall back there, that weird shadow right there. And then as you approach it, it disappears. Interesting graphics, as always. All right, here we go. Last call for the like button. Oh, man. Uh, you guys, as always, you guys are always awesome. I love you guys always so much. Don't ever go changing. One more time. Here we go. Let's make it happen. Day 199. The store is open for your convenience. One last time for the day. Let's make it happen. Grab all this stuff. Get it put up. Eventually, the stocker crew is going to be done. I don't know when, but I will just run with them and get stuff put up in, in case they're somehow behind. Uh, we will get this done. It is surprising that it took that long. Um, no, I would never say you're weird. I would never say that. Never say anyone in my, in my uh, chat is weird. Never. I'm the only one that's weird. You guys are all perfectly normal. I'm strange. So <laughs> we'll go with that. And, uh, okay, the brown label cereal. Now that goes there. And the other brown label cereal right about there. And then the vodka up there. And did I get another one of those by mistake? No, that's the eggs. And that goes there. Ah. And what else do we got? Uh, oh, yeah, the egg eights. That's going to go there. And, oh, the cute little box. The cute little egg fours. There they are. And uh, more egg eights. Right about there. Out of my way, sir. I don't know which one of that was. Which one of you that was. Might have been Mark. Um, he always trips me. And finally, a salt. There we go. That was like the, the few things of salt that we had. So let's get those, put them up there, and one more. Uh, Dan Larson, once again, thank you once again for the 10 gifted memberships. So let's see. Terry Gilbert, Steve Silent, uh, Joe Gibbs, Quicksand, uh, Barlin Tail, Radiant Armor, DJ Jared, JDF Videos, Terry Bradbury, and Vogali you got you golly vartak i'm sure i said that wrong welcome to the rusty champagne club courtesy of dan larson's generosity thank you so much uh, big ups for sure that is very awesome of you thank you so so much oh man again the, the generosity that you guys continue to show all the time uh just blows my mind and i am always eternally grateful for everything that you do. Um, uh, so, so again, thank you so, so much for all of your continued generosity. Um, it is really, really wonderful that you do such a thing. Um, got all the window chicken to put up. The last of it. And then we'll get some more ordered and bring it in. We love that chirp noise. We absolutely love that chirp noise. And that's the last of it. There we go. All right, let's get a few of them ordered. And right here to the computer. Uh, window chicken. That's what I want. One, two, three. And let's get those in there. And let's take a look around. What do we need? Uh, probably a couple milk six. Uh, we need a, yeah, we're going to get a couple milk six packs. We need a couple of the breads. Because I'm sure that they've run out of those in the process of doing this. So a couple of those. And let's see. What else do I need? Uh, we need, what else is completely out? Uh, tuna is completely out. Let's get some tuna. So a couple of tunas. And let's get these all ordered and brought in because there's none back here. So let's do that. Um, window chicken. I didn't really want that right now. Um, I could use other stuff, but I'll grab all the window chicken, set it right here for now because we cannot, we cannot disparage the window chicken. That will not stand. <laughs> cannot disparage our lovely window chicken even if it's not what we want to pick up at the moment we must always treat window chicken with proper reverence 
So there we go. And there's the last of it with reverence onto the pile. And tuna. That goes there. And then we got yeah, one more milk six pack and one more uh, bread. No, what is that? Oh, no, that's the milk six packs. It's both of them. Perfect. So now it looks like we need some Covidos. So I'm going to get one of those for sure because they might bring another one back for all I know. So we're going to get one. And uh, we need one of each of the sushis. So let's do that. One of each. Do that, that. And uh, then we've got what? Uh, if we go around, everything looks good. So keep going around. I can get a new toilet paper. So we'll do that. Oh, uh, what did I grab? I didn't mean that. Uh, that was not the plan. And it was that one, right? It was, yes. All right, here we go. Last time this stream. Everybody say it with me. Lights! There it is. That was a rather high-pitched one on top of that. Okay. Uh, two more things. What else can I get? Uh, get a couple of the new copies. Let's do that. And uh, five, six. Get all that ordered. And bring it in. So nice stack there of boxes. Run that in. And uh, grab that one. That's the toilet paper right about there. And there's our other sushi right down there with you. And then the Kobodo should be at the bottom of the stack. Yes, they are. And then this was the coffee. That's right, the new coffee. Right up there. Oh, no, get up there. And one more. There you are. Okay, 720. What else can we get? How are we doing? Uh, I'm looking around. I uh, guess we need more sushi because they immediately took that. So let's do that. So sushi, one. And uh, what else? I guess I can get some peppers. So we'll get a few artisanal peppers. Don't really need it, but we'll do it. So let's get that ordered and outside. Let's take a look. Um, maybe a few coffees and a few teas. So we'll do a few of those. So coffees, one, two, three. And teas, one, two, three. Order those. Get them outside. Is there anything else that I'm completely out of back here? Anything that's completely gone so that the night owls don't run me out? I better get one more sushi. Can I do it real quick? Let's do it one more. Large and order. Nope, I missed it. Ah! I couldn't hit the button in time. Oh, man. Definitely missed. <laughs> Just so close. Uh... A lights emoji, a window chicken emoji, all the emoji possibilities. So many possibilities for emojis. Um, and I'm pretty sure we do have room for plenty of emojis now because we have so many members. So, yeah, I know that we've got room for a, 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 number, of, uh, a number of additional emojis. That's what I'm trying to say. That's really what I'm trying to say. Uh, so, yeah. So if you know anyone who's good at emojis, um, bring it on. I am not good at that stuff. So, but yeah, we'd love more emojis for sure. All the rusty champagne emojis, all the things that make rusty champagne what it is. We would absolutely love them. No doubt about it. Okay. That's there. And finally, the pepper. Oh. Huh. And what is this last box here? That's the other artisanal pepper. Whew. I'm not helping. I'm sorry, Yoda. I'm sorry. Uh, I, I said nothing. Everything that I said, um, I take it back. Everything that I said, I, I didn't say anything. You heard nothing. I, I said nothing. Um, uh, so, no, I, I, I didn't say anything about emojis. I didn't say anything about giving Yoda more work. I didn't say that. No, I, I, there, you, you can't prove it. I didn't say it. So, no, that, that was not me. That was my doppelganger. My doppelganger, the radio DJ, who works for 97.1 WDRV, The Drive. Um, that was him. He did it. It's his fault. Um, flower, to you. What else can we get here real quick? I ordered the kegs. I ordered, is there anything over here I need? Uh, again, always a pasta. Always, and um, 
up there. Uh, uh, looking around. I guess I can get one of each of the toilet papers again. So let's do that. So one of each of you. Eight, nine. And <laughs> no, take your time on all that, Yoda. Definitely take your time. No rush on any of it. No rush at all on any of it. Do, do your things in your time. There's never a rush on any of this. Life is life is the most important thing. Um, so, no, take your time on all of it. That is, that's the most important thing. So, that's the, that's the thing that matters. I mean, emojis are emojis. They'll, they'll be here when they get here, and that's perfectly good. So, yeah. All right, let's grab all the bleach. We're going to help these guys out, try and get the rest of this stocked while we wait for the final people in the store. I should probably check the window chicken one last time. Wow, we're out of it. Okay. Uh, been derelict in my window chicken duty because I've been busy doing so many other things. So <laughs> that's okay. Got that. Got another one. Run it in here. And then we'll leave the one last one outside. I am actually going to open this one up. And let's set it down. Let's open it up so it has the proper seasoning. Because that's the most important part. Who's left? We got one left. Franz has the honors of having the last one. Emily B., how you doing? Happy Sunday to you. Glad you're here. Uh, we're just about getting ready to wrap up, but glad you're here nonetheless. Uh, level 68. Whoa. In the meantime, I'm happy to continue yelling lights. My husband is used to my weirdness now. <laughs> As long as he's in on it, that's all that matters. Day 199, yep, there was the window chicken, I'm sure. 83 happy, one grumpy, one who couldn't find their window chicken. I didn't pay the rent, that's fine, no biggie. We're up to $16,000 in the store, in the bank. Pizza, apple juice, and beer lager. So pizza, apple juice, and beer lager. Um, pizza, apple juice, so let's do the apple juice first. Still 275. Uh, pizza. Which of the pizzas was it? Was it you? Uh, yeah, maybe it was. $12. And the beer lager, which is the, uh, I don't remember which one that is. Oh, it must be you. Yeah, you're way down. $4. Not zero, $4. There it is. Whoa. Of course, escape key, because why not? Fred, you rocked it out again. I mean, all you guys, I know you were busting it. You were all absolutely busting it. And Matt, Max, Mark, and Marv, they were all rolling. All of you rolling. So lots happening. Uh, John G. Zark, welcome to Rusty Champagne. Thank you so much for subscribing. I am so glad you're here. I hope you're having a wonderful Sunday. It really is a wonderful Sunday. Um, Matt, Max, Mark, and Marv are going to keep on working. Let us make our way to our corner near the club at the end of the street. So in case you missed it, tomorrow's live stream, 4.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time, that wonderful wacky game, Center Station Simulator, going to learn more about our abandoned supermarket that we inherited from our grandfather that cannot accept deliveries but does accept people as we continue to grow trees in the basement as well as start fires next to the trees and make all kinds of ingots. <laughs> so we're going to have all kinds of fun. We're going to see what continues to go on with that game. Much love as always to Yoda. Much love as always to J-Dub. Uh, much love as always to, to what if he were here um, for all that they do. Um, uh, Faraz Hassin, welcome. Uh, glad you were able to make it just as we were getting ready to head on out. So that's what we got coming up tomorrow. Tomorrow morning, 8 a.m. Central Daylight Time, Countryside Life, a pre-recorded episode. We will have that also for your viewing pleasure. But that is going to be all for this one. Uh, if you're catching this one later and if you like it, I'd appreciate it if you gave it a like. If you really like this one and if you're not yet a subscriber, I would appreciate it even more if you considered giving the channel a subscribe. But until we meet again... Thank you, as always, for being a part of all this wonderful, beautiful silliness. I'm Rusty Champagne, and we will see you later.